Psalm. Chapter 1. O oh, the happiness of that one, who hath not walked in the counsel of the wicked! And in the way of sinners hath not stood, and in the seat of scorners hath not sat. But, in the law of Jehovah, is, his delight, and in his law he doth meditate by day and by night. And he hath been as a tree, planted by rivulets of water, that giveth its fruit in its season, and its leaf doth not wither, and all that he doth he causeth to prosper. Not so the wicked, but, as chaff that wind driveth away. Therefore the wicked rise not in judgment, nor sinners in the company of the righteous. For Jehovah is knowing the way of the righteous, and the way of the wicked is lost. Chapter 2 Why have nations tumultuously assembled? And do peoples meditate vanity? Station themselves do kings of the earth, and princes have been united together, against Jehovah, and against his Messiah. Let us draw off their cords, and cast from us their thick bands. He who is sitting in the heavens doth laugh, the Lord doth mock at them. Then doth he speak unto them in his anger, and in his wrath he doth trouble them. And I, I have anointed my king, upon Zion, my holy hill. I declare concerning a statute, Jehovah said unto me, My son thou, art, I today have brought thee forth. Ask of me and I give nations, thy inheritance, and thy possession the ends of earth. Thou dost rule them with a scepter of iron, as a vessel of a potter thou dost crush them. And now, O kings, act wisely, be instructed, O judges of earth. Serve ye Jehovah with fear, and rejoice with trembling. Kiss the chosen one, lest he be angry, and ye lose the way, when his anger burneth but a little, O the happiness of all trusting in him. Chapter 3 A Psalm of David in his fleeing from the face of Absalom his son. Jehovah, how have my distresses multiplied! Many are rising up against me. Many are saying of my soul, There is no salvation for him in God. Selah. And thou, O Jehovah, art, a shield for me, my honor, and lifter up of my head. My voice, is, unto Jehovah, I call, and he answereth me from his holy hill, Selah. I, I have lain down, and I sleep, I have waked, for Jehovah sustaineth me. I am not afraid of myriads of people, that round about they have set against me. Rise, O Jehovah! Save me, my God! Because thou hast smitten all mine enemies, on, the cheek. The teeth of the wicked thou hast broken. Of Jehovah, is, this salvation, on thy people, is, thy blessing. Selah. Chapter 4. To the Overseer with Stringed Instruments. A Psalm of David. In my calling answer thou me, O God of my righteousness. In adversity thou gavest enlargement to me, favor me, and hear my prayer. Sons of men. Till when, is, my glory for shame? Ye love a vain thing, ye seek a lie. Selah. And know ye that Jehovah hath separated a saintly one to himself. Jehovah heareth in my calling to him. Tremble ye, and do not sin, say ye, thus, in your heart on your bed, and be ye silent. Selah. Sacrifice ye sacrifices of righteousness, and trust ye unto Jehovah. Many are saying, Who doth show us good? Lift on us the light of thy face, O Jehovah. Thou hast given joy in my heart, from the time their corn and their wine have been multiplied. In peace together I lie down and sleep, for thou, O Jehovah, alone, in confidence dost cause me to dwell. Chapter 5 To the Overseer, Concerning the Inheritances A Psalm of David My sayings here, O Jehovah, consider my meditation. Be attentive to the voice of my cry, my King and my God, for unto thee I pray habitually. Jehovah, at, morning thou hearest my voice, at, morning I set in array for thee, and I look out. For not a God desiring wickedness, art, thou, evil inhabiteth thee not. The boastful station not themselves before thine eyes, thou hast hated all working iniquity. Thou destroyest those speaking lies, 
a man of blood and deceit Jehovah doth abominate. And I, in the abundance of thy kindness, I enter thy house, I bow myself toward thy holy temple in thy fear. O Jehovah, lead me in thy righteousness, because of those observing me, make straight before me thy way. For there is no stability in their mouth. Their heart, is, mischiefs, an open grave, is, their throat, their tongue they make smooth. Declare them guilty, O God, let them fall from their own counsels, in the abundance of their transgressions drive them away, because they have rebelled against thee. And rejoice do all trusting in thee, to the age they sing, and thou coverest them over, and those loving thy name exult in thee. For thou blessest the righteous, O Jehovah, as a buckler with favor dost compass him. Chapter 6 To the overseer with stringed instruments, on the octave. A Psalm of David. O Jehovah, in thine anger reprove me not, nor in thy fury chastise me. Favor me, O Jehovah, for I, am, weak, heal me, O Jehovah, for troubled have been my bones. And my soul hath been troubled greatly, and thou, O Jehovah, till when? Turn back, O Jehovah, draw out my soul, save me for thy kindness sake. For there is not in death thy memorial, in Sheol, who doth give thanks to thee. I have been weary with my sighing, I meditate through all the night, on, my bed, with my tear my couch I waste. Old from provocation is mine eye, it is old because of all mine adversaries. Turn from me all ye workers of iniquity, for Jehovah heard the voice of my weeping. Jehovah hath heard my supplication, Jehovah my prayer receiveth. Ashamed and troubled greatly are all mine enemies, they turn back, ashamed, in, a moment. Chapter 7 The Erring One, by David, that he sung to Jehovah concerning the words of Cush a Benjamite. O Jehovah, my God, in thee I have trusted, save me from all my pursuers, and deliver me. Lest he tear as a lion my soul, rending, and there is no deliverer. O Jehovah, my God, if I have done this, if there is iniquity in my hands. If I have done my well-wisher evil, and draw mine adversary without cause. An enemy pursueth my soul, and overtacketh, and treadeth down to the earth my life, and my honor placeth in the dust. Selah. Rise, O Jehovah, in thine anger, be lifted up at the wrath of mine adversaries, and awake thou for me, judgment thou hast commanded. And a company of peoples compass thee, and over it on high turn thou back. Jehovah doth judge the peoples, judge me, O Jehovah, according to my righteousness, and according to mine integrity on me. Let, I pray thee be ended the evil of the wicked, and establish thou the righteous, and a trier of hearts and reins is the righteous God. My shield, is, on God, Saviour of the upright in heart. God, is, a righteous judge, and he is not angry at all times. If, one, turn not, his sword he sharpeneth, his bow he hath trodden, he prepareth it. Yea, for him he hath prepared instruments of death, his arrows for burning pursuers he mocketh. Lo, he traveleth, with, iniquity, and he hath conceived perverseness, and hath brought forth falsehood. A pit he hath prepared, and he diggeth it, and he falleth into a ditch he mocketh. Return doth his perverseness on his head, and on his crown his violence cometh down. I thank Jehovah, according to his righteousness, and praise the name of Jehovah Most High. Chapter 8 To the Overseer, on the Giddeth A Psalm of David Jehovah, our Lord, how honorable thy name in all the earth! Who settest thine honor on the heavens. From the mouths of infants and sucklings thou hast founded strength, because of thine adversaries, to still an enemy and a self-avenger. For I see thy heavens, a work of thy fingers, moon and stars that thou didst establish. What, is, man that thou rememberest him? The son of man that thou inspectest him? And causest him to lack a little of Godhead, and with honor and majesty compassest him. Thou dost cause him to rule over the works of thy hands, all thou hast placed under his feet. Sheep and oxen, all of them, and also beasts of the field. Bird of the heavens, and fish of the sea, 
passing through the paths of the seas. Jehovah, our Lord, how honorable thy name in all the earth. Chapter 9 To the Overseer, on the death of Labben A Psalm of David I confess, O Jehovah, with all my heart, I recount all thy wonders. I rejoice and exult in thee, I praise thy name, O Most High. In mine enemies turning backward, they stumble and perish from thy face. For thou hast done my judgment and my right. Thou hast sat on a throne, a judge of righteousness. Thou hast rebuked nations, thou hast destroyed the wicked, their name thou hast blotted out to the age and for ever. O thou enemy, finished have been destructions for ever, as to cities thou hast plucked up, perished hath their memorial with them. And Jehovah to the age Abedeth, he is preparing for judgment his throne. And he judgeth the world in righteousness, he judgeth the peoples in uprightness. And Jehovah is a tower for the bruised, a tower for times of adversity. They trust in thee who do know thy name, for thou hast not forsaken those seeking thee, O Jehovah. Sing ye praise to Jehovah, inhabiting Zion, declare ye among the peoples his acts. For he who is seeking for blood them hath remembered, he hath not forgotten the cry of the afflicted. Favor me, O Jehovah, see mine affliction by those hating me, thou who liftest me up from the gates of death. So that I recount all thy praise, in the gates of the daughter of Zion. I rejoice on thy salvation. Sunk have nations in a pit they made, in a net that they hid hath their foot been captured. Jehovah hath been known, judgment he hath done, by a work of his hands hath the wicked been snared. Meditation. Selah. The wicked do turn back to Sheol, all nations forgetting God. For not for ever is the needy forgotten, the hope of the humble lost to the age. Rise, O Jehovah, let not man be strong, let nations be judged before thy face. Appoint, O Jehovah, a director to them, let nations know they, are, men. Selah. Chapter 10. Why, Jehovah, dost thou stand at a distance? Thou dost hide in times of adversity. Through the pride of the wicked, is the poor inflamed, they are caught in devices that they devised. Because the wicked hath boasted of the desire of his soul, and a dishonest gainer he hath blessed, he hath despised Jehovah. The wicked according to the height of his face, inquireth not. God is not. Are, all his devices. Pain do his ways at all times, on high, are, thy judgments before him, all his adversaries, he puffeth at them. He hath said in his heart, I am not moved, to generation and generation not in evil. Of oaths his mouth is full, and deceits, and fraud, under his tongue, is, perverseness and iniquity. He doth sit in an ambush of the villages, in secret places he doth slay the innocent. His eyes for the afflicted watch secretly. He leeth in wait in a secret place, as a lion in a covert. He leeth in wait to catch the poor, he catcheth the poor, drawing him into his net. He is bruised, he boweth down, fallen by his mighty ones hath the afflicted. He said in his heart, God hath forgotten, he hath hid his face, he hath never seen. Arise, O Jehovah! O God, lift up thy hand! Forget not the humble! Wherefore hath the wicked despised God? He hath said in his heart, It is not required. Thou hast seen, for thou perverseness and anger beholdest, by giving into thy hand, on thee doth the afflicted leave, it, of the fatherless thou hast been an helper. Break the arm of the wicked and the evil, seek out his wickedness, find none. Jehovah, is, king to the age, and for ever, the nations have perished out of his land. The desire of the humble thou hast heard, O Jehovah. Thou preparest their heart, thou causest thine ear to attend. To judge the fatherless and bruised, he addeth no more to oppress man of the earth. Chapter 11 To the Overseer By David In Jehovah I trusted, how say ye to my soul, they moved, to, thy mountain for the bird. For lo, the wicked tread about, they have prepared their arrow on the string, 
to shoot in darkness at the upright in heart. When the foundations are destroyed, the righteous, what hath he done? Jehovah, is, in his holy temple, Jehovah, in the heavens, is, his throne. His eyes see, his eyelids try the sons of men. Jehovah the righteous doth try. And the wicked and the lover of violence, hath his soul hated. He poureth on the wicked snares, fire, and brimstone, and a horrible wind, is, the portion of their cup. For righteous, is, Jehovah, righteousness he hath loved, the upright doth his countenance see. Chapter 12 To the Overseer, on the Octave A Psalm of David Save, Jehovah, for the saintly hath failed, for the steadfast have ceased from the sons of men. Vanity they speak each with his neighbor, lip of flattery. With heart and heart they speak. Jehovah doth cut off all lips of flattery, a tongue speaking great things. Who said, By our tongue we do mightily, our lips, are, our own, who, is, Lord over us? Because of the spoiling of the poor, because of the groaning of the needy, now do I arise, saith Jehovah, I set in safety, him who, doth breathe for it. Sayings of Jehovah, are, pure sayings, silver tried in a furnace of earth refined sevenfold. Thou, O Jehovah, dost preserve them, thou keepest us from this generation to the age. Around the wicked walk continually, according as vileness is exalted by sons of men. Chapter 13 To the Overseer A Psalm of David Till when, O Jehovah, dost thou forget me? Forever? Till when dost thou hide thy face from me? Till when do I set counsels in my soul? Sorrow in my heart daily? Till when is mine enemy exalted over me? Look attentively, answer me, O Jehovah, my God, enlighten mine eyes, lest I sleep in death. Lest mine enemy say, I overcame him, mine adversary's joy when I am moved. And I, in thy kindness I have trusted, rejoice doth my heart in thy salvation. I do sing to Jehovah, for he hath conferred benefits upon me. Chapter 14 To the Overseer By David a fool hath said in his heart, God is not, they have done corruptly, they have done abominable actions, there is not a doer of good. Jehovah from the heavens hath looked on the sons of men, to see if there is a wise one, seeking God. The whole have turned aside, together they have been filthy, there is not a doer of good, not even one. Have all working iniquity not known? Those consuming my people have eaten bread, Jehovah they have not called. There they have feared a fear, for God, is, in the generation of the righteous. The counsel of the poor ye cause to stink, because Jehovah, is, his refuge. Who doth give from Zion the salvation of Israel? When Jehovah doth turn back, to, a captivity of his people, Jacob doth rejoice, Israel is glad. Chapter 15 A Psalm of David Jehovah who doth sojourn in thy tent? Who doth dwell in thy holy hill? He who is walking uprightly, and working righteousness, and speaking truth in his heart. He hath not slandered by his tongue, he hath not done to his friend evil, and reproach he hath not lifted up against his neighbor. Despised in his eyes, is, a rejected one, and those fearing Jehovah he doth honor. He hath sworn to suffer evil, and changeth not. His silver he hath not given in usury, and a bribe against the innocent hath not taken, whoso is doing these is not moved to the age. Chapter 16 A Secret Treasure of David Preserve me, O God, for I did trust in Thee. Thou hast said to Jehovah, My Lord Thou, art, my good, is, not for Thine own sake. For the holy ones who, are, in the land, and the honorable, all my delight, is, in them. Multiplied are their griefs, who, have hastened backward, I pour not out their libations of blood, nor do I take up their names on my lee psalm. Jehovah, is, the portion of my share, and of my cup, thou, thou dost uphold my lot. Lines have fallen to me in pleasant places, yea, a beauteous inheritance, 
is, for me. I bless Jehovah who hath counseled me, also, in, the nights my reigns instruct me. I did place Jehovah before me continually, because, at my right hand I am not moved. Therefore hath my heart been glad, and my honour doth rejoice, also my flesh dwelleth confidently. For thou dost not leave my soul to Sheol, nor givest thy saintly one to see corruption. Thou causest me to know the path of life, fullness of joys, is, with thy presence, pleasant things by thy right hand for ever. Chapter 17 A Prayer of David Hear, O Jehovah, righteousness, attend my cry, give ear, to, my prayer, without lips of deceit. From before thee my judgment doth go out, thine eyes do see uprightly. Thou hast proved my heart, thou hast inspected by night, thou hast tried me, thou findest nothing, my thoughts pass not over my mouth. As to doings of man, through a word of thy lips I have observed the paths of a destroyer. To uphold my goings in thy paths, my steps have not slid den. I, I called thee, for thou dost answer me, O God, incline thine ear to me, hear my speech. Separate wonderfully thy kindness, O Saviour of the confiding, by thy right hand, from withstanders. Keep me as the apple, the daughter of the eye, in shadow of thy wings thou dost hide me. From the face of the wicked who spoiled me. Mine enemies in soul go round against me. Their fat they have closed up, their mouths have spoken with pride. Our steps now have compassed, him, their eyes they set to turn aside in the land. His likeness as a lion desirous to tear, as a young lion dwelling in secret places. Arise, O Jehovah, go before his face, cause him to bend. Deliver my soul from the wicked, thy sword. From men, thy hand, O Jehovah, from men of the world, their portion, is, in life, and, with, thy hidden things thou feest their belly, they are satisfied, with, sons, and have left their abundance to their sucklings. I, in righteousness, I see thy face, I am satisfied, in awaking, with, thy form. Chapter 18 To the Overseer By a servant of Jehovah, by David, who hath spoken to Jehovah the words of this song in the day Jehovah delivered him from the hand of all his enemies, and from the hand of Saul, and he saith, I love thee, O Jehovah, my strength. Jehovah, is, my rock, and my bulwark, and my deliverer, my God, is, my rock, I trust in him, my shield, and a horn of my salvation, my high tower. The praised one foot I call Jehovah, and from my enemies I am saved. Compassed me have cords of death, and streams of the worthless make me afraid. Cords of Sheol have surrounded me, before me have been snares of death. In mine adversity I call Jehovah, and unto my God I cry. He heareth from his temple my voice, and my cry before him cometh into his ears. And shake and tremble doth the earth, and foundations of hills are troubled, and they shake because he hath wrath. Gone up hath smoke by his nostrils, and fire from his mouth consumeth, coals have been kindled by it. And he inclineth the heavens, and cometh down, and thick darkness, is, under his feet. And he rideth on a cherub, and doth fly, and he fleeth on wings of wind. He mocketh darkness his secret place, round about him his tabernacle, darkness of waters, thick clouds of the skies. From the brightness over against him his thick clouds have passed on, hail and coals of fire. And thunder in the heavens doth Jehovah, and the Most High giveth forth his voice, hail and coals of fire. And he sendeth his arrows and scattereth them, and much lightning, and crusheth them. And seen are the streams of waters, and revealed are foundations of the earth. From thy rebuke, O Jehovah, from the breath of the Spirit of thine anger. He sendeth from above, he taketh me, he draweth me out of many waters. He delivereth me from my strong enemy, and from those hating me, for they have been stronger than I. They go before me in a day of my calamity and Jehovah is for a support to me. And he bringeth me forth to a large place, he draweth me out, because he delighted in me. 
Jehovah doth recompense me according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands, he doth return to me. For I have kept the ways of Jehovah, and have not done wickedly against my God. For all his judgments, are, before me, and his statutes I turn not from me. And I am perfect with him, and I keep myself from mine iniquity. And Jehovah doth return to me, according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands, over against his eyes. With the kind thou showest thyself kind, with a perfect man showest thyself perfect. With the pure thou showest thyself pure, and with the perverse showest thyself a wrestler. For thou a poor people savest, and the eyes of the high causest to fall. For thou, thou lightest my lamp, Jehovah my God enlighteneth my darkness. For by thee I run, a troop. And by my God I leap a wall. God. Perfect, is, his way, the saying of Jehovah is tried, a shield, is, he to all those trusting in him. For who, is, God besides Jehovah? And who, is, a rock save our God? God. Who is girding me, with, strength, and he mocketh perfect my way. Making my feet like hinds, and on my high places causeth me to stand. Teaching my hands for battle, and a bow of brass was brought down by my arms. And thou givest to me the shield of thy salvation, and thy right hand doth support me, and thy lowliness mocketh me great. Thou enlargest my step under me, and mine ankles have not slid den. I pursue mine enemies, and overtake them, and turn back not till they are consumed. I smite them, and they are not able to rise, they fall under my feet. And thou girdest me, with, strength for battle, causest my withstanders to bow under me. As to mine enemies, thou hast given to me the neck, as to those hating me, I cut them off. They cry, and there is no Saviour, on Jehovah, and he doth not answer them. And I beat them as dust before wind, as mire of the streets I empty them out. Thou dost deliver me from the strivings of the people, thou placest me for a head of nations, a people I have not known do serve me. At the hearing of the ear they hearken to me, sons of a stranger feign obedience to me. Sons of a stranger fade away, and are slain out of their close places. Jehovah liveth and blessed, is, my rock, and exalted is the God of my salvation. God, who is giving vengeance to me, and he subdueth peoples under me. My deliverer from mine enemies, above my withstanders thou raisest me, from a man of violence dost deliver me. Therefore I confess thee among nations, O Jehovah, and to thy name I sing praise. Magnifying the salvation of his king, and doing kindness to his anointed, to David, and to his seed, unto the age. Chapter 19 To the Overseer A Psalm of David the heavens, are, recounting the honor of God, and the work of his hands the expanse, is, declaring. Day to day uttereth speech, and night to night sheweth knowledge. There is no speech, and there are no words. Their voice hath not been heard. Into all the earth hath their line gone forth, and to the end of the world their sayings, for the sun he placed a tent in them. And he, as a bridegroom, goeth out from his covering, he rejoiceth as a mighty one to run the path. From the end of the heavens, is, his going out, and his revolution, is, unto their ends, and nothing is hid from his heat. The law of Jehovah, is, perfect, refreshing the soul, the testimonies of Jehovah, are, steadfast, making wise the simple. The precepts of Jehovah, are, upright, rejoicing the heart, the command of Jehovah, is, pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of Jehovah, is, clean, standing to the age, the judgments of Jehovah, are, true, they have been righteous, together. They are more desirable than gold, yeah, than much fine gold, and sweeter than honey, even liquid honey of the comb. Also, thy servant is warned by them, in keeping them, is, a great reward. Errors. Who doth understand? From hidden ones declare me innocent. Also, from presumptuous ones keep back thy servant, let them not rule over me, then am I perfect, 
and declared innocent of much transgression. Let the sayings of my mouth, and the meditation of my heart, be for a pleasing thing before thee, O Jehovah, my rock, and my Redeemer. Chapter 20 To the Overseer A Psalm of David Jehovah doth answer thee, in a day of adversity, the name of the God of Jacob doth set thee on high. He doth send thy help from the sanctuary, and from Zion doth support thee. He doth remember all thy presence, and thy burnt offering doth reduce to ashes. Selah. He doth give to thee according to thy heart, and all thy counsel doth fulfill. We sing of thy salvation, and in the name of our God set up a banner. Jehovah doth fulfill all thy requests. Now I have known that Jehovah hath saved his anointed, he answereth him from his holy heavens, with the saving might of his right hand. Some of chariots, and some of horses, and we of the name of Jehovah our God make mention. They, they have bowed and have fallen, and we have risen and station ourselves upright. O Jehovah, save the king, he doth answer us in the day we call. Chapter 21 To the Overseer a Psalm of David. Jehovah, in thy strength is the king joyful, in thy salvation how greatly he rejoiceth. The desire of his heart thou gavest to him, and the request of his lips thou hast not withheld. Selah. For thou puttiest before him blessings of goodness, thou settest on his head a crown of fine gold. Life he hath asked from thee, thou hast given to him, length of days, age during, and for ever. Great, is, his honour in thy salvation, honour and majesty thou placest on him. For thou makest him blessings for ever, thou dost cause him to rejoice with joy, by thy countenance. For the king is trusting in Jehovah, and in the kindness of the Most High he is not moved. Thy hand cometh to all thine enemies, thy right hand doth find thy haters. Thou makest them as a furnace of fire, at the time of thy presence. Jehovah in his anger doth swallow them, and fire doth devour them. Their fruit from earth thou destroyest, and their seed from the sons of men. For they stretched out against the evil, they devised a wicked device, they prevail not. For thou makest them a butt, when thy strings thou preparest against their faces. Be thou exalted, O Jehovah in, thy strength, we sing and we praise thy might. Chapter 22 to the overseer, on the hind of the morning. A Psalm of David. My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Far from my salvation, the words of my roaring. My God, I call by day, and thou answerest not, and by night, and there is no silence to me. And thou, art, holy, sitting, the praise of Israel. In thee did our fathers trust, they trusted, and thou dost deliver them. Unto thee they cried, and were delivered, in thee they trusted, and were not ashamed. And I, am, a worm, and no man, a reproach of man, and despised of the people. All beholding me do mock at me, they make free with the lip, shake the head. Roll unto Jehovah, he doth deliver him, he doth deliver him, for he delighted in him. For thou, art, he bringing me forth from the womb, causing me to trust, on the breasts of my mother. On thee I have been cast from the womb, from the belly of my mother thou, art, my God. Be not far from me, for adversity is near, for there is no helper. Many bulls have surrounded me, mighty ones of Bashan have compassed me. They have opened against me their mouth, a lion tearing and roaring. As waters I have been poured out, and separated themselves have all my bones, my heart hath been like wax, it is melted in the midst of my bowels. Dried up as an earthen vessel is my power, and my tongue is cleaving to my jaws. And to the dust of death thou appointest me, for surrounded me have dogs, a company of evil doers have compassed me, piercing my hands and my feet. I count all my bones, they look expectingly, they look upon me. They apportion my garments to themselves, and for my clothing they cause a lot to fall. And thou, O Jehovah, be not far off, O my strength, to help me haste. Deliver from the sword my soul, from the paw of a dog mine only one. Save me from the mouth of a lion, and from the horns of the high places thou hast answered me. 
I declare thy name to my brethren, in the midst of the assembly I praise thee. Ye who fear Jehovah, praise ye him, all the seed of Jacob, honour ye him, and be afraid of him, all ye seed of Israel. For he hath not despised, nor abominated, the affliction of the afflicted, nor hath he hidden his face from him, and in his crying unto him he heareth. Of thee my praise, is, in the great assembly. My vows I complete before his fearers. The humble do eat and are satisfied, praise Jehovah do those seeking him, your heart doth live for ever. Remember and return unto Jehovah, do all ends of the earth, and before thee bow themselves, do all families of the nations. For to Jehovah, is, the kingdom, and he is ruling among nations. And the fat ones of earth have eaten, and they bow themselves, before him bow do all going down to dust, and he, who, hath not revived his soul. A seed doth serve him, it is declared of the Lord to the generation. They come and declare his righteousness, to a people that is born, that he hath made. Chapter 23 A Psalm of David Jehovah, is, my shepherd, I do not lack. In pastures of tender grass he causeth me to lie down, by quiet waters he doth lead me. My soul he refresheth, he leadeth me in paths of righteousness, for his name's sake. Also, when I walk in a valley of death shade, I fear no evil, for thou, art, with me, thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou arrangest before me a table, over against my adversaries, thou hast anointed with oil my head, my cup is full. Only, goodness and kindness pursue me, all the days of my life, and my dwelling, is, in the house of Jehovah, for a length of days. Chapter 24 A Psalm of David To Jehovah, is, the earth and its fullness, the world and the inhabitants in it. For he on the seas hath founded it, and on the floods he doth establish it. Who goeth up into the hill of Jehovah? And who riseth up in his holy place? The clean of hands, and pure of heart, who hath not lifted up to vanity his soul, nor hath sworn to deceit. He beareth away a blessing from Jehovah, righteousness from the God of his salvation. This, is, a generation of those seeking him. Seeking thy face, O Jacob. Selah. Lift up, O gates, your heads, and be lifted up, O doors age during, and come and doth the King of glory. Who, is, this, the King of glory? Jehovah, strong and mighty, Jehovah, the mighty in battle. Lift up, O gates, your heads, and be lifted up, O doors age during, and come and doth the King of glory. Who, is, he, this King of glory? Jehovah of hosts, he, is, the King of glory. Selah. Chapter 25 By David Unto thee, O Jehovah, my soul I lift up. My God, in thee I have trusted, let me not be ashamed, let not mine enemies exult over me. Also let none waiting on thee be ashamed, let the treacherous dealers without cause be ashamed. Thy ways, O Jehovah, cause me to know, thy paths teach thou me. Cause me to tread in thy truth, and teach me, for thou, art, the God of my salvation, near thee I have waited all the day. Remember thy mercies, O Jehovah, and thy kindnesses, for from the age, are, they. Sins of my youth, and my transgressions, do not thou remember. According to thy kindness be mindful of me, for thy goodness sake, O Jehovah. Good and upright, is, Jehovah, therefore he directeth sinners in the way. He causeth the humble to tread in judgment, and teacheth the humble his way. All the paths of Jehovah, are, kindness and truth, to those keeping his covenant, and his testimonies. For thy name's sake, O Jehovah, thou hast pardoned mine iniquity, for it, is, great. Who, is, this, the man fearing Jehovah? He directeth him in the way he doth choose. His soul and good doth remain, and his seed doth possess the land. The secret of Jehovah, is, for those fearing him, and his covenant, to cause them to know. Mine eyes, are, continually unto Jehovah, for he bringeth out from a net my feet. Turn thou unto me, 
and favor me, for lonely and afflicted, am, I. The distresses of my heart have enlarged themselves, for my distresses bring me out. See mine affliction and my misery, and bear with all my sins. See my enemies, for they have been many, and with violent hatred they have hated me. Keep my soul, and deliver me, let me not be ashamed, for I trusted in thee. Integrity and uprightness do keep me, for I have waited, on, thee. Redeem Israel, O God, from all his distresses. Chapter 26 By David Judge me, O Jehovah, for I in mine integrity have walked, and in Jehovah I have trusted, I slide not. Try me, O Jehovah, and prove me, purified, are, my reins and my heart. For thy kindness, is, before mine eyes, and I have walked habitually in thy truth. I have not sat with vain men, and with dissemblers I enter not. I have hated the assembly of evil doers, and with the wicked I sit not. I wash in innocency my hands, and I compass thine altar, O Jehovah. To sound with a voice of confession, and to recount all thy wonders. Jehovah, I have loved the habitation of thy house, and the place of the tabernacle of thine honor. Do not gather with sinners my soul, and with men of blood my life. In whose hand, is, a wicked device, and their right hand, is, full of bribes. And I, in mine integrity I walk, redeem me, and favor me. My foot hath stood in uprightness, in assemblies I bless Jehovah. Chapter 27 By David Jehovah, is, my light and my salvation, whom do I fear? Jehovah, is, the strength of my life, of whom am I afraid? When evil doers come near to me to eat my flesh, my adversaries and mine enemies to me, they have stumbled and fallen. Though a host doth encamp against me, my heart doth not fear, though war riseth up against me, in this I, am, confident. One, thing, I asked of Jehovah, it I seek. My dwelling in the house of Jehovah, all the days of my life, to look on the pleasantness of Jehovah, and to inquire in his temple. For he hideth me in a tabernacle in the day of evil, he hideth me in a secret place of his tent, on a rock he riseth me up. And now, lifted up is my head, above my enemies, my surrounders, and I sacrifice in his tent sacrifices of shouting, I sing, yeah, I sing praise to Jehovah. Hear, O Jehovah, my voice, I call, and favor me, and answer me. To thee said my heart they sought my face, thy face, O Jehovah, I seek. Hide not thy face from me, turn not aside in anger thy servant, my help thou hast been. Leave me not, nor forsake me, O God of my salvation. When my father and my mother have forsaken me, then doth Jehovah gather me. Shew me, O Jehovah, thy way, and lead me in a path of uprightness, for the sake of my beholders. Give me not to the will of my adversaries, for risen against me have false witnesses, and they breathe out violence to me. I had not believed to look on the goodness of Jehovah in the land of the living. Look unto Jehovah be strong, and he doth strengthen thy heart, yea, look unto Jehovah. Chapter 28 By David Unto thee, O Jehovah, I call, my rock, be not silent to me. Lest thou be silent to me, and I have been compared with those going down to the pit. Hear the voice of my supplications, in my crying unto thee, in my lifting up my hands toward thy holy oracle. Draw me not with the wicked, and with workers of iniquity, speaking peace with their neighbors, and evil in their heart. Give to them according to their acting, and according to the evil of their doings. According to the work of their hands give to them. Return their deed to them. For they attend not to the doing of Jehovah, and unto the work of his hands. He throweth them down, and doth not build them up. Blessed, is, Jehovah, for he hath heard the voice of my supplications. Jehovah, is, my strength, and my shield, in him my heart trusted, and I have been helped. And my heart exulteth, and with my song I thank him. Jehovah, is, strength to him, yea, the strength of the salvation of his anointed, is, he. Save thy people, 
and bless thine inheritance, and feed them, and carry them to the age. Chapter 29 A Psalm of David Ascribe to Jehovah, ye sons of the mighty, ascribe to Jehovah honor and strength. Ascribe to Jehovah the honor of his name, bow yourselves to Jehovah, in the beauty of holiness. The voice of Jehovah, is, on the waters, the God of glory hath thundered, Jehovah, is, on many waters. The voice of Jehovah, is, with power, the voice of Jehovah, is, with majesty. The voice of Jehovah, is, shivering cedars, yeah, Jehovah shivers the cedars of Lebanon. And he causeth them to skip as a calf, Lebanon and Sirion as a son of Reems. The voice of Jehovah is hewing fiery flames. The voice of Jehovah paineth a wilderness, Jehovah paineth the wilderness of Kadesh. The voice of Jehovah paineth the oaks, and mocketh bare the forests, and in his temple every one saith, Glory. Jehovah on the deluge hath sat, and Jehovah sitteth king, to the age. Jehovah strength to his people giveth, Jehovah blesseth his people with peace. Chapter 30 A Psalm A Song of the Dedication of the House of David I exalt thee, O Jehovah, for thou hast drawn me up, and hast not let mine enemies rejoice over me. Jehovah my God, I have cried to thee, and thou dost heal me. Jehovah, thou hast brought up from Sheol my soul, thou hast kept me alive, from going down, to, the pit. Sing praise to Jehovah, ye his saints, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. For, a moment, is, in his anger, life, is, in his goodwill, at even remaineth weeping, and at morn singing. And I, I have said in mine ease, I am not moved to the age. O Jehovah, in thy good pleasure, thou hast caused strength to remain for my mountain, thou hast hidden thy face, I have been troubled. Unto thee, O Jehovah, I call, and unto Jehovah I make supplication. What gain, is, in my blood? In my going down unto corruption? Doth dust thank thee? Doth it declare thy truth? Hear, O Jehovah, and favor me, O Jehovah, be a helper to me. Thou hast turned my mourning to dancing for me, thou hast loosed my sackcloth, and girdest me, with, joy. So that honor doth praise thee, and is not silent, O Jehovah, my God, to the age I thank thee. Chapter 31 To the Overseer A Psalm of David In thee, O Jehovah, I have trusted, let me not be ashamed to the age, in thy righteousness deliver me. Incline unto me thine ear hastily, deliver me, be to me for a strong rock, for a house of bulwarks to save me. For my rock and my bulwark, art, thou, for thy name's sake lead me and tend me. Bring me out from the net that they hid for me, for thou, art, my strength. Into thy hand I commit my spirit, thou hast redeemed me, Jehovah God of truth. I have hated the observers of lying vanities, and I toward Jehovah have been confident. I rejoice, and am glad in thy kindness, in that thou hast seen mine affliction, thou hast known in adversities my soul. And thou hast not shut me up, into the hand of an enemy, thou hast caused my feet to stand in a broad place. Favor me, O Jehovah, for distress, is, to me, mine eye, my soul, and my body have become old by provocation. For my life hath been consumed in sorrow and my years in sighing. Feeble because of mine iniquity hath been my strength, and my bones have become old. Among all mine adversaries I have been a reproach, and to my neighbors exceedingly, and a fear to mine acquaintances, those seeing me without, fled from me. I have been forgotten as dead out of mind, I have been as a perishing vessel. For I have heard an evil account of many, fear, is, roundabout. In their being united against me, to take my life they have devised. And I on thee, I have trusted, O Jehovah, I have said, Thou, art, my God. In thy hand, are, my times, deliver me from the hand of my enemies, and from my pursuers. Cause thy face to shine on thy servant, save me in thy kindness. 
O Jehovah, let me not be ashamed, for I have called thee, let the wicked be ashamed, let them become silent to Sheol. Let lips of falsehood become dumb, that are speaking against the righteous, ancient sayings, in pride and contempt. How abundant is thy goodness, that thou hast laid up for those fearing thee. Thou hast wrought for those trusting in thee, before sons of men. Thou hidest them in the secret place of thy presence, from artifices of man, thou concealest them in a tabernacle, from the strife of tongues. Blessed, is, Jehovah, for he hath made marvellous his kindness to me in a city of bulwarks. And I, I have said in my haste, I have been cut off from before thine eyes, but thou hast heard the voice of my supplications, in my crying unto thee. Love Jehovah, all ye his saints, Jehovah is keeping the faithful, and recompensing abundantly a proud doer. Be strong, and he strengtheneth your heart, all ye who are waiting for Jehovah. Chapter 32 By David An Instruction O oh, the happiness of him whose transgression, is, forgiven, whose sin is covered. O oh, the happiness of a man, to whom Jehovah imputeth not iniquity, and in whose spirit there is no deceit. When I have kept silence, become old have my bones, through my roaring all the day. When by day and by night thy hand is heavy upon me, my moisture hath been changed into the droughts of summer. Selah. My sin I cause thee to know, and mine iniquity I have not covered. I have said, I confess concerning my transgressions to Jehovah, and thou, thou hast taken away, the iniquity of my sin. Selah. For this doth every saintly one pray to thee, as the time to find. Surely at an overflowing of many waters, unto him they come not. Thou, art, a hiding place for me, from distress thou dost keep me, with, songs of deliverance dost compass me. Selah. I cause thee to act wisely, and direct thee in the way that thou goest, I cause mine eye to take counsel concerning thee. Be ye not as a horse, as a mule, without understanding, with bridle and bit, its ornaments, to curb, not to come near unto thee. Many, are, the pains of the wicked, as to him who is trusting in Jehovah, kindness doth compass him. Be glad in Jehovah, and rejoice, ye righteous, and sing, all ye upright of heart. Chapter 33 Sing, ye righteous, in Jehovah, for upright one's praise, is, comely. Give ye thanks to Jehovah with a harp, with psaltery of ten strings sing praise to him. Sing ye to him a new song, play skillfully with shouting. For upright, is, the word of Jehovah, and all his work, is, in faithfulness. Loving righteousness and judgment, of the kindness of Jehovah is the earth full. By the word of Jehovah the heavens have been made, and by the breath of his mouth all their host. Gathering as a heap the waters of the sea, putting in treasuries the depths. Afraid of Jehovah are all the earth, of him are all the inhabitants of the world afraid. For he hath said, and it is, he hath commanded, and it standeth. Jehovah made void the counsel of nations, he disallowed the thoughts of the peoples. The counsel of Jehovah to the age standeth, the thoughts of his heart to all generations. O oh, the happiness of the nation whose God, is, Jehovah, of the people he did choose, for an inheritance to him. From the heavens hath Jehovah looked, he hath seen all the sons of men. From the fixed place of his dwelling, he looked unto all inhabitants of the earth. Who is forming their hearts together, who is attending unto all their works. The king is not saved by the multitude of a force. A mighty man is not delivered, by abundance of power. A false thing, is, the horse for safety, and by the abundance of his strength he doth not deliver. Lo, the eye of Jehovah, is, to those fearing him, to those waiting for his kindness. To deliver from death their soul, and to keep them alive in famine. Our soul hath waited for Jehovah, our help and our shield, is, he. For in him doth our heart rejoice, for in his holy name we have trusted. Let thy kindness, O Jehovah, be upon us, as we have waited for thee. Chapter 34 By David, in his changing his behavior before Abimelech, and he driveth him away, 
and he goeth. I do bless Jehovah at all times, continually his praise, is, in my mouth. In Jehovah doth my soul boast herself, here do the humble and rejoice. Ascribe ye greatness to Jehovah with me, and we exalt his name together. I sought Jehovah, and he answered me, and from all my fears did deliver me. They looked expectingly unto him, and they became bright, and their faces are not ashamed. This poor, one, called, and Jehovah heard, and from all his distresses saved him. A messenger of Jehovah is encamping, round about those who fear him, and he armeth them. Taste ye and see that Jehovah, is, good, O oh, the happiness of the man who trusteth in him. Fear Jehovah, ye his holy ones, for there is no lack to those fearing him. Young lions have lacked and been hungry, and those seeking Jehovah lack not any good. Come ye, children, hearken to me, the fear of Jehovah I do teach you. Who, is, the man that is desiring life? Loving days to see good? Keep thy tongue from evil, and thy lips from speaking deceit. Turn aside from evil and do good, seek peace and pursue it. The eyes of Jehovah, are, unto the righteous, and his ears unto their cry. The face of Jehovah, is, on doers of evil, to cut off from earth their memorial. They cried, and Jehovah heard, and from all their distresses delivered them. Near, is, Jehovah to the broken of heart, and the bruised of spirit he saveth. Many, are, the evils of the righteous, out of them all doth Jehovah deliver him. He is keeping all his bones, one of them hath not been broken. Evil doth put to death the wicked, and those hating the righteous are desolate. Jehovah redeemeth the soul of his servants, and none trusting in him are desolate. Chapter 35 By David Strive, Jehovah, with my strivers, fight with my fighters. Take hold of shield and buckler, and rise for my help. And draw out spear and lance, to meet my pursuers. Say to my soul, Thy salvation I, am. They are ashamed and blush, those seeking my soul, turned backward and confounded, those devising my evil. They are as chaff before wind, and a messenger of Jehovah driving away. Their way is darkness and slipperiness, and a messenger of Jehovah their pursuer. For without cause they hid for me their net pit, without cause they digged for my soul. Meet him doth desolation, he knoweth not, and his net that he hid catcheth him, for desolation he falleth into it. And my soul is joyful in Jehovah, it rejoiceth in his salvation. All my bones say, Jehovah, who is like thee, delivering the poor from the stronger than he, and the poor and needy from his plunderer. Violent witnesses rise up, that which I have not known they ask me. They pay me evil for good, bereaving my soul. And I, in their sickness my clothing, is, sackcloth, I have humbled with fastings my soul, and my prayer unto my bosom returneth. As, if, a friend, as, if, my brother, I walked habitually, as a mourner for a mother, mourning I have bowed down. And, in my halting they have rejoiced, and have been gathered together, gathered against me were the smiters, and I have not known, they have rent, and they have not ceased. With profane ones, mockers in feasts, gnashing against me their teeth. Lord, how long dost thou behold? Keep back my soul from their desolations, from young lions my only one. I thank thee in a great assembly, among a mighty people I praise thee. Mine enemies rejoice not over me, with, falsehood, those hating me without cause wink the eye. For they speak not peace, and against the quiet of the land, deceitful words they devise. And they enlarge against me their mouth, they said, Aha, aha, our eye hath seen. Thou hast seen, O Jehovah, be not silent, O Lord, be not far from me. Stir up, and wake to my judgment, my God, and my Lord, to my plea. Judge me according to thy righteousness, O Jehovah my God, and they do not rejoice over me. They do not say in their heart, Aha, our desire. They do not say, We swallowed him up. They are ashamed and confounded together, who are rejoicing at my evil. They put on shame and confusion, 
who are magnifying themselves against me. They sing and rejoice, who are desiring my righteousness, and they say continually, Jehovah is magnified, who is desiring the peace of his servant. And my tongue uttereth thy righteousness, all the day thy praise. Chapter 36 To the Overseer By a servant of Jehovah, by David The transgression of the wicked is affirming within my heart, fear of God is not before his eyes. For he made, it, smooth to himself in his eyes, to find his iniquity to be hated. The words of his mouth, are, iniquity and deceit, he ceased to act prudently, to do good. Iniquity he deviseth on his bed, he stationeth himself on a way not good, evil he doth not refuse. O Jehovah, in the heavens, is, thy kindness, thy faithfulness, is, unto the clouds. Thy righteousness, is, as mountains of God, thy judgments, are, a great deep. Man and beast thou savest, O Jehovah. How precious, is, thy kindness, O God, and the sons of men in the shadow of thy wings do trust. They are filled from the fatness of thy house, and the stream of thy delights thou dost cause them to drink. For with thee, is, a fountain of life, in thy light we see light. Draw out thy kindness to those knowing thee, and thy righteousness to the upright of heart. Let not a foot of pride meet me, and a hand of the wicked let not move me. There have workers of iniquity fallen, they have been overthrown, and have not been able to arise. Chapter 37 By David Do not fret because of evil doers, be not envious against doers of iniquity. For as grass speedily they are cut off, and as the greenness of the tender grass do fade. Trust in Jehovah, and do good, dwell, in, the land, and enjoy faithfulness. And delight thyself on Jehovah, and he giveth to thee the petitions of thy heart. Roll on Jehovah thy way, and trust upon him, and he worketh. And hath brought out as light thy righteousness, and thy judgment as noonday. Be silent for Jehovah, and stay thyself for him, do not fret because of him who is making prosperous his way, because of a man doing wicked devices. Desist from anger, and forsake fury, fret not thyself only to do evil. For evil doers are cut off, as to those waiting on Jehovah, they possess the land. And yet a little, and the wicked is not, and thou hast considered his place, and it is not. And the humble do possess the land, and they have delighted themselves in the abundance of peace. The wicked is devising against the righteous, and gnashing against him his teeth. The Lord doth laugh at him, for he hath seen that his day cometh. A sword have the wicked opened, and they have trodden their bow, to cause to fall the poor and needy, to slaughter the upright of the way. Their sword doth enter into their own heart, and their bows are shivered. Better, is, the little of the righteous, than the store of many wicked. For the arms of the wicked are shivered, and Jehovah is sustaining the righteous. Jehovah knoweth the days of the perfect, and their inheritance is, to the age. They are not ashamed in a time of evil, and in days of famine they are satisfied. But the wicked perish, and the enemies of Jehovah, as the preciousness of lambs, have been consumed, in smoke they have been consumed. The wicked is borrowing and repayeth not, and the righteous is gracious and giving. For his blessed ones do possess the land, and his reviled ones are cut off. From Jehovah, are, the steps of a man, they have been prepared, and his way he desireth. When he falleth, he is not cast down, for Jehovah is sustaining his hand. Young I have been, I have also become old, and I have not seen the righteous forsaken, and his seed seeking bread. All the day he is gracious and lending, and his seed, is, for a blessing. Turn aside from evil, and do good, and dwell to the age. For Jehovah is loving judgment, and he doth not forsake his saintly ones, to the age they have been kept, and the seed of the wicked is cut off. The righteous possess the land, and they dwell for ever on it. The mouth of the righteous uttereth wisdom, and his tongue speaketh judgment. The law of his God, is, his heart, his steps do not slide. The wicked is watching for the righteous, and is seeking to put him to death. Jehovah doth not leave him in his hand, 
nor condemn him in his being judged. Look unto Jehovah, and keep his way, and he doth exalt thee to possess the land, in the wicked being cut off, thou sayest. I have seen the wicked terrible, and spreading as a green native plant. And he passeth away, and lo, he is not, and I seek him, and he is not found. Observe the perfect, and see the upright, for the latter end of each, is, peace. And transgressors were destroyed together, the latter end of the wicked was cut off. And the salvation of the righteous, is, from Jehovah, their strong place in a time of adversity. And Jehovah doth help them and deliver them, he delivereth them from the wicked, and salveth them, because they trusted in him. Chapter 38 A Psalm of David, to cause to remember. Jehovah, in thy wrath reprove me not, nor in thy fury chastise me. For thine arrows have come down on me, and thou lettest down upon me thy hand. Soundness is not in my flesh, because of thine indignation, peace is not in my bones because of my sin. For mine iniquities have passed over my head, as a heavy burden, too heavy for me. Stunk, become corrupt have my wounds, because of my folly. I have been bent down, I have been bowed down, unto excess, all the day I have gone mourning. For my flanks have been full of drought, and soundness is not in my flesh. I have been feeble and smitten, unto excess, I have roared from disquietude of heart. Lord, before thee, is, all my desire, and my sighing from thee hath not been hid. My heart, is, panting, my power hath forsaken me, and the light of mine eyes, even they are not with me. My lovers and my friends over against my plague stand. And my neighbors afar off have stood. And those seeking my soul lay a snare, and those seeking my evil have spoken mischievous things, and they do deceits meditate all the day. And I, as deaf, hear not. And as a dumb one who openeth not his mouth. Yea, I am as a man who heareth not, and in his mouth are no reproofs. Because for thee, O Jehovah, I have waited, thou dost answer, O Lord my God. When I said, Lest they rejoice over me, in the slipping of my foot against me they magnified themselves. For I am ready to halt, and my pain, is, before me continually. For mine iniquity I declare, I am sorry for my sin. And mine enemies, are, lively, they have been strong, and those hating me without cause, have been multiplied. And those paying evil for good accuse me, because of my pursuing good. Do not forsake me, O Jehovah, my God, be not far from me. Haste to help me, O Lord, my salvation. Chapter 39 To the Overseer, to Jeduthun. A Psalm of David. I have said, I observe my ways, against sinning with my tongue, I keep from my mouth a curb, while the wicked, is, before me. I was dumb, with, silence, I kept silent from good, and my pain is excited. Hot, is, my heart within me, in my meditating doth the fire burn, I have spoken with my tongue. Cause me to know, O Jehovah, mine end, and the measure of my days, what it, is, I know how frail I, am. Lo, handbreadths thou hast made my days, and mine age, is, as nothing before thee, only, all vanity, is, every man set up. Selah. Only, in an image doth each walk habitually, only, in, vain, they are disquieted, he heapeth up and knoweth not who gathereth them. And, now, what have I expected? O Lord, my hope, it, is, of thee. From all my transgressions deliver me, a reproach of the fool make me not. I have been dumb, I open not my mouth, because thou, thou hast done, it. Turn aside from off me thy stroke, from the striving of thy hand I have been consumed. With reproofs against iniquity, thou hast corrected man, and dost waste as a moth his desirableness, only, vanity, is, every man. Selah. Hear my prayer, O Jehovah, and, to, my cry give ear, unto my tear be not silent, for a sojourner I, am, with thee, a settler like all my fathers. Look from me, and I brighten up before I go and am not. Chapter 40 
To the Overseer A Psalm of David I have diligently expected Jehovah, and he inclineth to me, and heareth my cry. And he doth cause me to come up from a pit of desolation from mire of mud, and he riseth up on a rock my feet, he is establishing my esteem psalm. And he putteth in my mouth a new song, praise to our God. Many do see and fear, and trust in Jehovah. O oh, the happiness of the man who hath made Jehovah his trust, and hath not turned unto the proud, and those turning aside to lies. Much hast thou done, Jehovah my God, thy wonders and thy thoughts toward us, there is none to arrange unto thee, I declare and speak, they have been more than to be numbered. Sacrifice and present thou hast not desired, ears thou hast prepared for me, burnt and sin offering thou hast not asked. Then said I, Lo, I have come, in the roll of the book it is written of me. To do thy pleasure, my God, I have delighted, and thy law, is, within my heart. I have proclaimed tidings of righteousness in the great assembly, lo, my lips I restrain not, O Jehovah, thou hast known. Thy righteousness I have not concealed in the midst of my heart, thy faithfulness and thy salvation I have told, I have not hidden thy kindness and thy truth, to the great assembly. Thou, O Jehovah, restrainest not thy mercies from me, thy kindness and thy truth do continually keep me. For compassed me have evils innumerable, overtaken me have mine iniquities, and I have not been able to see, they have been more than the hairs of my head, and my heart hath forsaken me. Be pleased, O Jehovah, to deliver me, O Jehovah, for my help make haste. They are ashamed and confounded together, who are seeking my soul to destroy it, they are turned backward, and are ashamed, who are desiring my evil. They are desolate because of their shame, who are saying to me, Aha, aha! All seeking thee rejoice and are glad in thee, those loving thy salvation say continually, Jehovah is magnified. And I, am, poor and needy, the Lord doth devise for me. My help and my deliverer, art, thou, O my God, tarry thou not. Chapter 41 To the Overseer A Psalm of David O oh, the happiness of him who is acting wisely unto the poor, in a day of evil doth Jehovah deliver him. Jehovah doth preserve him and revive him, he is happy in the land, and thou givest him not into the will of his enemies. Jehovah supporteth on a couch of sickness, all his bed thou hast turned in his weakness. I, I said, O Jehovah, favor me, heal my soul, for I did sin against thee. Mine enemies say evil of me, when he dieth his name hath perished. And if he came to see, vanity he speaketh, his heart gathereth iniquity to itself, he goeth out, at the street he speaketh. All hating me whisper together against me, against me they devise evil to me. A thing of Belial is poured out on him, and because he lay down he riseth not again. Even mine ally, in whom I trusted, one eating my bread, made great the heel against me. And thou, Jehovah, favor me, and cause me to rise, and I give recompense to them. By this I have known, that thou hast delighted in me, because my enemy shouteth not over me. As to me, in mine integrity, thou hast taken hold upon me, and causest me to stand before thee to the age. Blessed, is, Jehovah, God of Israel, from the age and unto the age. Amen and Amen. Chapter 42 to the Overseer. An Instruction. By Sons of Korah. As a heart doth pant for streams of water, so my soul panteth toward thee, O God. My soul thirsted for God, for the living God, when do I enter and see the face of God? My tear hath been to me bread day and night, in their saying unto me all the day, Where, is, thy God? These I remember, and pour out my soul in me, for I pass over into the booth, I go softly with them unto the house of God, with the voice of singing and confession, the multitude keeping feast. What? Boast thou thyself, O my soul? Yea, art thou troubled within me? Wait for God, for still I confess him, the salvation of my countenance, my God. In me doth my soul bow itself, therefore I remember thee from the land of Jordan, and of the Hermans, from the hill Mizar. 
Deep unto deep is calling at the noise of thy water spouts, all thy breakers and thy billows passed over me. By day Jehovah commendeth his kindness, and by night a song, is, with me, a prayer to the God of my life. I say to God my rock, why hast thou forgotten me? Why go I mourning in the oppression of an enemy? With a sword in my bones have mine adversaries reproached me, in their saying unto me all the day, Where, is, thy God? What? Boast thou thyself, O my soul? And what? Art thou troubled within me? Wait for God, for still I confess him, the salvation of my countenance, and my God. Chapter 43 Judge me, O God, and plead my cause against a nation not pious, from a man of deceit and perverseness thou dost deliver me. For thou, art, the God of my strength. Why hast thou cast me off? Why morning do I go up and down, in the oppression of an enemy? Send forth thy light and thy truth, they, they lead me, they bring me in, unto thy holy hill, and unto thy tabernacles. And I go in unto the altar of God, unto God, the joy of my rejoicing. And I thank thee with a harp, O God, my God. What? Boast thou thyself, O my soul? And what? Art thou troubled within me? Wait for God, for still I confess him, the salvation of my countenance, and my God. Chapter 44 To the Overseer By Sons of Korah An Instruction O God, with our ears we have heard, our fathers have recounted to us, the work thou didst work in their days, in the days of old. Thou, with, thy hand, nations hast dispossessed. And thou dost plant them. Thou afflictest peoples, and sendest them away. For, not by their sword possessed they the land, and their arm gave not salvation to them, but thy right hand, and thine arm, and the light of thy countenance, because thou hadst accepted them. Thou, art, he, my king, O God, command the deliverances of Jacob. By thee our adversaries we do push, by thy name tread down our withstanders. For, not in my bow do I trust, and my sword doth not save me. For thou hast saved us from our adversaries, and those hating us thou hast put to shame. In God we have boasted all the day, and thy name to the age we thank. Selah. In anger thou hast cast off and causest us to blush, and goest not forth with our hosts. Thou causest us to turn backward from an adversary, and those hating us, have spoiled for themselves. Thou makest us food like sheep, and among nations thou hast scattered us. Thou sellest thy people without wealth, and hast not become great by their price. Thou makest us a reproach to our neighbors, a scorn and a reproach to our surrounders. Thou makest us a simile among nations, a shaking of the head among peoples. All the day my confusion, is, before me, and the shame of my face hath covered me. Because of the voice of a reproacher and reviler, because of an enemy and a self-avenger. All this met us, and we did not forget thee, nor have we dealt falsely in thy covenant. We turn not backward our heart, nor turn aside doth our step from thy path. But thou hast smitten us in a place of dragons, and dost cover us over with death shade. If we have forgotten the name of our God, and spread our hands to a strange God. Doth not God search out this? For he knoweth the secrets of the heart. Surely, for thy sake we have been slain all the day, reckoned as sheep of the slaughter. Stir up, why dost thou sleep, O Lord? Awake, cast us not off for ever. Why thy face hidest thou? Thou forgettest our afflictions and our oppression. For bowed to the dust hath our soul, cleaved to the earth hath our belly. Arise, a help to us, and ransom us for thy kindness sake. Chapter 45 To the Overseer On the Lilies By Sons of Korah An Instruction A Song of Loves my heart hath indeed a good thing, I am telling my works to a king, my tongue, is, the pen of a speedy writer. Thou hast been beautified above the sons of men, grace hath been poured into thy lips, 
therefore hath God blessed thee to the age. Gird thy sword upon the thigh, O mighty, thy glory and thy majesty. As to thy majesty, prosper. Ride. Because of truth, and meekness, righteousness, and thy right hand showeth thee fearful things. Thine arrows, are, sharp, peoples fall under thee, in the heart of the enemies of the king. Thy throne, O God, is, age during, and for ever, a scepter of uprightness, is, the scepter of thy kingdom. Thou hast loved righteousness and hatest wickedness, therefore God, thy God, hath anointed thee, oil of joy above thy companions. Myrrh and aloes, Kasha. All thy garments, out of palaces of ivory stringed instruments have made thee glad. Daughters of kings, are, among thy precious ones, a queen hath stood at thy right hand, in pure gold of Ophir. Hearken, O daughter, and see, incline thine ear, and forget thy people, and thy father's house. And the king doth desire thy beauty, because he, is, thy lord, bow thyself to him. And the daughter of Tyre with a present, the rich of the people do appease thy face. All glory, is, the daughter of the king within, of gold embroidered work, is, her clothing. In divers colors she is brought to the king, virgins, after her, her companions, are brought to thee. They are brought with joy and gladness, they come into the palace of the king. Instead of thy fathers are thy sons, thou dost appoint them for princes in all the earth. I make mention of thy name in all generations, therefore do peoples praise thee, to the age, and for ever. Chapter 46 To the Overseer By Sons of Korah For the Virgins A Song God, is, to us a refuge and strength, a help in adversities found most surely. Therefore we fear not in the changing of earth, and in the slipping of mountains into the heart of the seas. Roar, troubled are its waters, mountains they shake in its pride. Selah. A river, its rivulets rejoice the city of God, thy holy place of the tabernacles of the Most High. God, is, in her midst, she is not moved, God doth help her at the turn of the morn. Troubled have been nations, moved have been kingdoms, he hath given forth with his voice, earth melteth. Jehovah of hosts, is, with us, a tower for us, is, the God of Jacob. Selah. Come ye, see the works of Jehovah, who hath done astonishing things in the earth. Causing wars to cease, unto the end of the earth, the bow he shivereth, and the spear he hath cut asunder, chariots he doth burn with fire. Desist, and know that I, am, God, I am exalted among nations, I am exalted in the earth. Jehovah of hosts, is, with us, a tower for us, is, the God of Jacob. Selah. Chapter 47. To the Overseer. By Sons of Korah. A Psalm. All ye peoples, clap the hand, shout to God with a voice of singing. For Jehovah Most High, is, fearful, a great king over all the earth. He letteth peoples under us, and nations under our feet. He doth choose for us our inheritance, the excellency of Jacob that he loves. Selah. God hath gone up with a shout, Jehovah with the sound of a trumpet. Praise God, praise, give praise to our King, praise. For King of all the earth, is, God, give praise, O understanding one. God hath reigned over nations, God hath sat on his holy throne. Nobles of peoples have been gathered, with, the people of the God of Abraham, for to God, are, the shields of earth, greatly hath he been exalted. Chapter 48 A Song, A Psalm, by Sons of Korah Great, is, Jehovah, and praised greatly, in the city of our God, his holy hill. Beautiful, for, elevation, a joy of all the land, is, Mount Zion, the sides of the north, the city of a great king. God in her high places is known for a tower. For, lo, the kings met, they passed by together. They have seen, so they have marveled, they have been troubled, they were hastened away. Trembling hath seized them there, pain, as of a traveling woman. 
by an east wind thou shiverest ships of Tarshish. As we have heard, so we have seen, in the city of Jehovah of hosts, in the city of our God, God doth establish her, to the age. Selah. We have thought, O God, of thy kindness, in the midst of thy temple. As, is, thy name, O God, so, is, thy praise, over the ends of the earth, righteousness hath filled thy right hand. Rejoice doth Mount Zion, the daughters of Judah are joyful, for the sake of thy judgments. Compass Zion, and go round her, count her towers. Set your heart to her bulwark, consider her high places, so that ye recount to a later generation. That this God, is, our God, to the age and for ever, he, he doth lead us over death. Chapter 49 To the Overseer By Sons of Korah A Psalm Hear this, all ye peoples, give ear, all ye inhabitants of the world. Both low and high, together rich and needy. My mouth speaketh wise things, and the meditations of my heart, are, things of understanding. I incline to a simile mine ear, I open with a harp my riddle. Why do I fear in days of evil? The iniquity of my supplanters doth compass me. Those trusting on their wealth, and in the multitude of their riches, do shew themselves foolish. A brother doth no one at all ransom, he doth not give to God his atonement. And precious, is, the redemption of their soul, and it hath ceased, to the age. And still he liveth for ever, he seeth not the pit. For he seeth wise men die, together the foolish and brutish perish, and have left to others their wealth. Their heart, is, their houses, are, to the age, their tabernacles to all generations. They proclaimed their names over the lands. And man in honor doth not remain, he hath been like the beasts, they have been cut off. This their way, is, folly for them, and their posterity with their sayings are pleased. Selah. As sheep for Sheol they have set themselves, death doth afflict them, and the upright rule over them in the morning, and their form, is, for consumption. Sheol, is, a dwelling for him. Only, God doth ransom my soul from the hand of Sheol, for he doth receive me. Selah. Fear not, when one mocketh wealth, when the honor of his house is abundant. For at his death he receiveth nothing, his honor goeth not down after him. For his soul and his life he blesseth, and they praise thee when thou dost well for thyself. It cometh to the generation of his fathers, for ever they see not the light. Man in honor, who understandest not, hath been like the beasts, they have been cut off. Chapter 50 A Psalm of Azaph The God of gods, Jehovah, hath spoken, and he calleth to the earth from the rising of the sun unto its going in. From Zion, the perfection of beauty, God shone. Our God cometh, and is not silent, fire before him doth devour, and round about him it hath been very tempestuous. He doth call unto the heavens from above, and unto the earth, to judge his people. Gather ye to me my saints, making covenant with me over a sacrifice. And the heavens declare his righteousness, for God himself, is, judge. Selah. Hear, O my people, and I speak, O Israel, and I testify against thee, God, thy God, am, I. Not for thy sacrifices do I reprove thee, yea, thy burnt offerings, are, before me continually. I take not from thy house a bullock, from thy folds he goats. For mine, is, every beast of the forest, the cattle on the hills of oxen. I have known every fowl of the mountains, and the wild beast of the field, is, with me. If I am hungry I tell not to thee, for mine, is, the world and its fullness. Do I eat the flesh of bulls, and drink the blood of he-goats? Sacrifice to God confession, and complete to the Most High thy vows. And call me in a day of adversity, I deliver thee, and thou honorest me. And to the wicked hath God said, What to thee to recount my statutes? That thou liftest up my covenant on thy mouth? Yea, thou hast hated instruction, and dost cast my words behind thee. If thou hast seen a thief, then thou art pleased with him, 
and with adulterers, is, thy portion. Thy mouth thou hast sent forth with evil, and thy tongue joineth deceit together. Thou sittest, against thy brother thou speakest, against a son of thy mother givest slander. These thou didst, and I kept silent, thou hast thought that I am like thee, I reprove thee, and set in array before thine eyes. Understand this, I pray you, ye who are forgetting God, lest I tear, and there is no deliverer. He who is sacrificing praise honoureth me, as to him who mocketh away, I cause him to look on the salvation of God. Chapter 51 To the Overseer A Psalm of David, in the coming in unto him of Nathan the prophet, when he hath gone in unto Bathsheba. Favour me, O God, according to thy kindness, according to the abundance of thy mercies, blot out my transgressions. Thoroughly wash me from mine iniquity, and from my sin cleanse me. For my transgressions I do know, and my sin, is, before me continually. Against thee, thee only, I have sinned, and done the evil thing in thine eyes, so that thou art righteous in thy words, thou art pure in thy judging. Lo, in iniquity I have been brought forth, and in sin doth my mother conceive me. Lo, truth thou hast desired in the inward parts, and in the hidden part wisdom thou causest me to know. Thou cleansest me with hyssop and I am clean, washest me, and then snow I am whiter. Thou causest me to hear joy and gladness, thou makest joyful bones thou hast bruised. Hide thy face from my sin. And all mine iniquities blot out. A clean heart prepare for me, O God, and a right spirit renew within me. Cast me not forth from thy presence, and thy Holy Spirit take not from me. Restore to me the joy of thy salvation, and a willing spirit doth sustain me. I teach transgressors thy ways, and sinners unto thee do return. Deliver me from blood, O God, God of my salvation, my tongue singeth of thy righteousness. O Lord, my lips thou dost open, and my mouth declareth thy praise. For thou desirest not sacrifice, or I give, it, burnt offering thou acceptest not. The sacrifices of God, are, a broken spirit, a heart broken and bruised, O God, thou dost not despise. Do good in thy good pleasure with Zion, thou dost build the walls of Jerusalem. Then thou desirest sacrifices of righteousness, burnt offering, and whole burnt offering, then they offer bullocks on thine altar. Chapter 52 To the Overseer An instruction, by David, in the coming in of Dog the Edomite, and he declareth to Saul, and saith to him, David came in unto the house of Ahimelech. What, boasteth thou in evil, O mighty one? The kindness of God, is, all the day. Mischiefs doth thy tongue devise, like a sharp razor, working deceit. Thou hast loved evil rather than good, lying, than speaking righteousness. Selah. Thou hast loved all devouring words, O thou deceitful tongue. Also God doth break thee down for ever, taketh thee, and pulleth thee out of the tent, and he hath uprooted thee out of the land of the living. Selah. And the righteous see, and fear, and laugh at him. Lo, the man who mocketh not God his strong place, and trusteth in the abundance of his riches, he is strong in his mischiefs. And I, as a green olive in the house of God, I have trusted in the kindness of God, to the age and for ever. I thank thee to the age, because thou hast done, it, and I wait, on, thy name for, it is, good before thy saints. Chapter 53 To the Overseer On a Disease An Instruction, by David A fool said in his heart, There is no God. They have done corruptly, yea, they have done abominable iniquity, there is none doing good. God from the heavens looked on the sons of men, to see if there be an understanding one, one, seeking God. Every one went back, together they became filthy, there is none doing good, not even one. Have not workers of iniquity known, those eating my people have eaten bread, God they have not called. There they feared a fear, there was no fear, for God hath scattered the bones of him who is encamping against thee, thou hast put to shame, for God hath despised them. 
Who doth give from Zion the salvation of Israel? When God turneth back, to, a captivity of his people, Jacob doth rejoice, Israel is glad. Chapter 54 To the Overseer with Stringed Instruments An instruction, by David, in the coming in of the Ziphim, and they say to Saul, Is not David hiding himself with us? O God, by thy name save me, and by thy might judge me. O God, hear my prayer, give ear to the sayings of my mouth. For strangers have risen up against me and terrible ones have sought my soul, they have not set God before them. Selah. Lo, God, is, a helper to me, the Lord, is, with those supporting my soul. Turn back doth the evil thing to mine enemies, in thy truth cut them off. With a free will offering I sacrifice to thee, I thank thy name, O Jehovah, for, it is, good. For, from all adversity he delivered me, and on mine enemies hath mine I looked. Chapter 55 To the Overseer with Stringed Instruments An Instruction, by David Give ear, O God, to, my prayer, and hide not from my supplication. Attend to me, and answer me, I mourn in my meditation, and make a noise. Because of the voice of an enemy, because of the oppression of the wicked, for they cause sorrow to move against me, and in anger they hate me. My heart is pained within me, and terrors of death have fallen on me. Fear and trembling come into me, and horror doth cover me. And I say, Who doth give to me opinion as a dove? I fly away and rest. Lo, I move far off, I lodge in a wilderness. Selah. I hasten escape for myself, from a rushing wind, from a whirlwind. Swallow up, O Lord, divide their tongue, for I saw violence and strife in a city. By day and by night they go round it, on its walls. Both iniquity and perverseness, are, in its midst. Mischiefs, are, in its midst. Fraud and deceit depart not from its street. For an enemy reproacheth me not, or I bear, it, he who is hating me hath not magnified himself against me, or I hide from him. But thou, a man, as mine equal, my familiar friend, and mine acquaintance. When together we sweeten counsel, into the house of God we walk in company. Desolations, are, upon them, they go down, to, Sheol, alive, for wickedness, is, in their dwelling, in their midst. I, to God I call, and Jehovah saveth me. Evening, and morning, and noon, I meditate, and make a noise, and he heareth my voice. He hath ransomed in peace my soul from him who is near to me, for with the multitude they were with me. God doth hear and afflict them, and he sitteth of old. Selah because they have no changes, and fear not God. He hath sent forth his hands against his well-wishers, he hath polluted his covenant. Sweeter than honey hath been his mouth, and his heart, is, war. Softer have been his words than oil, and they, are, drawn, swords. Cast on Jehovah that which he hath given thee, and he doth sustain thee, he doth not suffer for ever the moving of the righteous. And thou, O God, Dost bring them down to a pit of destruction, men of blood and deceit reach not to half their days, and I, I do trust in thee. Chapter 56 To the Overseer On the dumb dove far off A secret treasure of David, in the Philistines taking hold of him in Gath. Favor me, O God, for man swallowed me up, all the day fighting he oppresseth me. Mine enemies have swallowed up all the day, for many, are, fighting against me, O Most High. The day I am afraid I am confident toward thee. In God I praise his word, in God I have trusted, I fear not what flesh doth to me. All the day they rest my words, concerning me all their thoughts, are, for evil. They assemble, they hide, they watch my heels, when they have expected my soul. By iniquity they escape, in anger the peoples put down, O God. My wandering thou hast counted, thou, place thou my tear in thy bottle, are they not in thy book? Then turn back do mine enemies in the day I call. This I have known, that God, is, 
for me. In God I praise the word, in Jehovah I praise the word. In God I trusted, I fear not what man doth to me. On me, O God, are, thy vows, I repay thank offerings to thee. For thou hast delivered my soul from death, dost thou not my feet from falling? To walk habitually before God in the light of the living. Chapter 57 To the Overseer Destroy not. A secret treasure of David, in his fleeing from the face of Saul into a cave. Favor me, O God, favor me, for in thee is my soul trusting, and in the shadow of thy wings I trust, until the calamities pass over. I call to God Most High, to God, who, is perfecting for me. He sendeth from the heaven, and salveth me, he reproached, who is panting after me. Selah. God sendeth forth his kindness and his truth. My soul, is, in the midst of lions, I lie down, among, flames, sons of men, their teeth, are, a spear and arrows, and their tongue a sharp sword. Be thou exalted above the heavens, O God, above all the earth thine honor. A net they have prepared for my steps, bowed down hath my soul, they have digged before me a pit, they have fallen into its midst. Selah. Prepared is my heart, O God, prepared is my heart, I sing and praise. Awake, mine honor, awake, psaltery and harp, I awake the morning dawn. I thank thee among the peoples, O Lord, I praise thee among the nations. For great unto the heavens, is, thy kindness, and unto the clouds thy truth. Be thou exalted above the heavens, O God. Above all the earth thine honor. Chapter 58 To the Overseer Destroy not. A Secret Treasure, by David Is it true, O dumb one, righteously ye speak? Uprightly ye judge, O sons of men? Even in heart ye work iniquities, in the land the violence of your hands ye ponder. The wicked have been estranged from the womb, they have erred from the belly, speaking lies. Their poison, is, as poison of a serpent, as a deaf asp shutting its ear. Which hearkeneth not to the voice of whisperers, a charmer of charms most skillful. O God, break their teeth in their mouth, the jaw teeth of young lions break down, O Jehovah. They are melted as waters, they go up and down for themselves, his arrow proceedeth as they cut themselves off. As a snail that melteth he goeth on, as, an untimely birth of a woman, they have not seen the sun. Before your pots discern the bramble, as well the raw as the heated he whirleth away. The righteous rejoiceth that he hath seen vengeance, his steps he washeth in the blood of the wicked. And man saith, Surely fruit, is, for the righteous, surely there is a God judging in the earth. Chapter 59 To the Overseer Destroy not, by David. A secret treasure, in Saul's sending, and they watched the house to put him to death. Deliver me from mine enemies, O my God, from my withstanders set me on high. Deliver me from workers of iniquity, and from men of blood save me. For, lo, they laid wait for my soul, assembled against me are strong ones, not my transgression nor my sin, O Jehovah. Without punishment they run and prepare themselves, stir up to meet me, and see. And thou, Jehovah, God of hosts, God of Israel, awake to inspect all the nations. Favor not any treacherous dealers of iniquity. Selah. They turn back at evening, they make a noise like a dog, and go round about the city. Lo, they belch out with their mouths, swords, are, in their lips, for who heareth? And thou, O Jehovah, dost laugh at them, thou dost mock at all the nations. O my strength, unto thee I take heed, for God, is, my tower, the God of my kindness. God doth go before me, he causeth me to look on mine enemies. Slay them not, lest my people forget, shake them by thy strength, and bring them down, O Lord our shield. The sin of their mouth, is, a word of their lips, and they are captured in their pride, and from the curse and lying they recount. Consume in fury, consume and they are not, 
and they know that God is ruling in Jacob, to the ends of the earth. Selah. And they turn back at evening, they make a noise like a dog, and they go round about the city. They, they wander for food, if they are not satisfied, then they murmur. And I, I sing, of, thy strength, and I sing at morn, of, thy kindness, for thou hast been a tower to me, and a refuge for me in a day of adversity. O my strength, unto thee I sing praise, for God, is, my tower, the God of my kindness. Chapter 60 To the Overseer Concerning the lily of testimony, a secret treasure of David, to teach, in his striving with Aram Naharaim, and with Aram Zobah, and Joab turneth back and smitteth Edom in the valley of salt, twelve thousand. O God, thou hadst cast us off, thou hadst broken us, hadst been angry. Thou dost turn back to us. Thou hast caused the land to tremble, thou hast broken it, heal its breaches, for it hath moved. Thou hast shown thy people a hard thing, thou hast caused us to drink wine of trembling. Thou hast given to those fearing thee an ensign. To be lifted up as an ensign because of truth Selah. That thy beloved ones may be drawn out, save, with, thy right hand, and answer us. God hath spoken in his holiness, I exult, I apportion Shechem, and the valley of Sukkis I measure. Mine, is, Gilead, and mine, is, Manasseh, and Ephraim, is, the strength of my head, Judah, is, my lawgiver. Moab, is, my pot for washing, over Edom I cast my shoe, shout, concerning me, O Philistia. Who doth bring me, to, a city of bulwarks? Who hath led me unto Edom? Is it not thou, O God? Hast thou cast us off? And dost thou not go forth, O God, with our hosts? Give to us help from adversity, and vain, is, the deliverance of man. In God we do mightily, and he treadeth down our adversaries. Chapter 61 To the Overseer, on Stringed Instruments By David Hear, O God, my loud cry, attend to my prayer. From the end of the land unto thee I call, in the feebleness of my heart, into a rock higher than I thou dost lead me. For thou hast been a refuge for me, a tower of strength because of the enemy. I sojourn in thy tent to the ages, I trust in the secret place of thy wings. Selah. For thou, O God, hast hearkened to my vows, thou hast appointed the inheritance of those fearing thy name. Days to the days of the king thou addest, his years as generation and generation. He dwelleth to the age before God, kindness and truth appoint, they keep him. So do I praise thy name for ever, when I pay my vows day by day. Chapter 62 To the Overseer, for Jeduthun. A Psalm of David. Only, toward God, is, my soul silent, from him, is, my salvation. Only, he, is, my rock, and my salvation, my tower, I am not much moved. Till when do ye devise mischief against a man? Ye are destroyed all of you, as a wall inclined, a hedge that is cast down. Only, from his excellency they have consulted to drive away, they enjoy a lie, with their mouth they bless, and with their heart revile. Selah. Only, for God, be silent, O my soul, for from him, is, my hope. Only, he, is, my rock and my salvation, my tower, I am not moved. On God, is, my salvation, and my honor, the rock of my strength, my refuge, is, in God. Trust in him at all times, O people, pour forth before him your heart, God, is, a refuge for us. Selah. Only, vanity, are, the low, a lie the high. In balances to go up they than vanity, are, lighter. Trust not in oppression, and in robbery become not vain, wealth when it increaseth, set not the heart. Once hath God spoken, twice I heard this, that strength, is, with God. And with thee, O Lord, is, kindness, for thou dost recompense to each, according to his work. Chapter 63 
A Psalm of David, in his being in the wilderness of Judah. O God, thou, art, my God, earnestly do I seek thee, thirsted for thee hath my soul, longed for thee hath my flesh, in a land dry and weary, without waters. So in the sanctuary I have seen thee, to behold thy strength and thine honor. Because better, is, thy kindness than life, my lips do praise thee. So I bless thee in my life, in thy name I lift up my hands. As, with, milk and fatness is my soul satisfied, and, with, singing lips doth my mouth praise. If I have remembered thee on my couch, in the watches, I meditate on thee. For thou hast been a help to me, and in the shadow of thy wings I sing. Cleaved hath my soul after thee, on me hath thy right hand taken hold. And they who for desolation seek my soul, go into the lower parts of the earth. They cause him to run on the edge of the sword, a portion for foxes they are. And the king doth rejoice in God, boast himself doth every one swearing by him, but stopped is the mouth of those speaking lies. Chapter 64 To the Overseer A Psalm of David Hear, O God, my voice, in my meditation, from the fear of an enemy thou keepest my life. Hidest me from the secret counsel of evil doers, from the tumult of workers of iniquity. Who sharpened as a sword their tongue, they directed their arrow a bitter word. To shoot in secret places the perfect, suddenly they shoot him, and fear not. They strengthen for themselves an evil thing, they recount of the hiding of snares, they have said, Who doth look at it? They search out perverse things, we perfected a searching search, and the inward part of man, and the heart, are, deep. And God doth shoot them, with, an arrow, sudden have been their wounds. And they cause him to stumble, against them, is, their own tongue, every looker on them fleeth away. And all men fear, and declare the work of God, and his deed they have considered wisely. The righteous doth rejoice in Jehovah, and hath trusted in him, and boast themselves do all the upright of heart. Chapter 65 To the Overseer A Psalm of David A Song To thee, silence, praise, O God, is, in Zion, and to thee is a vow completed. Hearer of prayer, to thee all flesh cometh. Matters of iniquities were mightier than I, our transgressions, thou dost cover them. O oh, the happiness of, him whom, thou choosest, and drawest near, he inhabiteth thy courts, we are satisfied with the goodness of thy house, thy holy temple. By fearful things in righteousness thou answerest us, O God of our salvation, the confidence of all far-off ends of earth and sea. Establishing mountains by his power, he hath been girded with might. Restraining the noise of seas, the noise of their billows, and the multitude of the peoples. And the inhabitants of the uttermost parts from thy signs are afraid, the outgoings of morning and evening thou causest to sing. Thou hast inspected the earth, and waterest it, thou makest it very rich, the rivulet of God, is, full of water, thou preparest their corn, when thus thou dost prepare it. Its ridges have been filled, deepened hath been its furrow, with showers thou dost soften it, it springing up thou blessest. Thou hast crowned the year of thy goodness, and thy paths drop fatness. Drop to the pastures of a wilderness, and joy of the heights thou girdest on. Clothed have lambs the flock, and valleys are covered with corn, they shout, yeah, they sing. Chapter 66 To the Overseer A Song, A Psalm Shout ye to God, all the earth. Praise ye the honor of his name, make ye honorable his praise. Say to God, how fearful, are, thy works, by the abundance of thy strength, thine enemies feign obedience to thee. All the earth do bow to thee, they sing praise to thee, they praise thy name. Selah. Come ye, and see the works of God, fearful acts toward the sons of men. He hath turned a sea to dry land, through a river they pass over on foot, there do we rejoice in him. Ruling by his might to the age, his eyes among the nations do watch, the refractory exalt not themselves. Selah. Bless, ye peoples, our God, and sound the voice of his praise. 
who hath placed our soul in life, and suffered not our feet to be moved. For thou hast tried us, O God, thou hast refined us as the refining of silver. Thou hast brought us into a net, thou hast placed pressure on our loins. Thou hast caused man to ride at our head. We have entered into fire and into water, and thou bringest us out to a watered place. I enter thy house with burnt offerings, I complete to thee my vows. For opened were my lips, and my mouth spake in my distress. Burnt offerings of fatlings I offer to thee, with perfume of rams, I prepare a bullock with he goats. Selah. Come, hear, all ye who fear God, and I recount what he did for my soul. Unto him, with, my mouth I have called, and exaltation, is, under my tongue. Iniquity, if I have seen in my heart, the Lord doth not hear. But God hath heard, he hath attended to the voice of my prayer. Blessed, is, God, who hath not turned aside my prayer, and his loving kindness, from me. Chapter 67 To the Overseer, with Stringed Instruments A Psalm, a Song God doth favor us and bless us, doth cause his face to shine with us. Selah. For the knowledge in earth of thy way, among all nations of thy salvation. Praise thee do peoples, O God, praise thee do peoples, all of them. Rejoice and sing do nations, for thou judgest peoples uprightly, and peoples on earth comfortest. Selah. Confess thee do peoples, O God, confess thee do peoples, all of them. Earth hath given her increase, God doth bless us, our God. God doth bless us, and all ends of earth fear him. Chapter 68 To the Overseer A Psalm, a Song of David Rise doth God, scattered are his enemies. And those hating him flee from his face. As the driving away of smoke thou drivest away, as the melting of wax before fire, the wicked perish at the presence of God. And the righteous rejoice, they exult before God, and they joy with gladness. Sing ye to God, praise his name, raise up a highway for him who is riding in deserts, in Jah, is, his name, and exult before him. Father of the fatherless, and judge of the widows, is, God in his holy habitation. God, causing the lonely to dwell at home, bringing out bound ones into prosperity, only, the refractory have inhabited a dry place. O God, in thy going forth before thy people, in thy stepping through the wilderness, Selah. The earth hath shaken, yea, the heavens have dropped before God, this Sinai, before God, the God of Israel. A shower of free will gifts thou shakest out, O God. Thine inheritance, when it hath been weary, thou hast established it. Thy company have dwelt in it, thou preparest in thy goodness for the poor, O God. The Lord doth give the saying, the female proclaimers, are, a numerous host. Kings of hosts flee utterly away, and a female inhabitant of the house apportioneth spoil. Though ye do lie between two boundaries, wings of a dove covered with silver, and her pinions with yellow gold. When the mighty spreadeth kings in it, it doth snow in salmon. A hill of God, is, the hill of Bashan, a hill of heights, is, the hill of Bashan. Why do ye envy, O high hills, the hill God hath desired for his seat? Jehovah also doth tabernacle for ever. The chariots of God, are, myriads, thousands of changes, the Lord, is, among them, in Sinai, in the sanctuary. Thou hast ascended on high, thou hast taken captive captivity, thou hast taken gifts for men, that even the refractory may rest, O Jah God. Blessed, is, the Lord, day by day he layeth on us. God himself, is, our salvation. Selah. God himself, is, to us a God for deliverances, and Jehovah Lord hath the outgoings of death. Only, God doth smite the head of his enemies, the hairy crown of a habitual walker in his guilt. The Lord said, From Bashan I bring back, I bring back from the depths of the sea. So that thou dashest thy foot in blood, in the blood of, enemies, the tongue of thy dogs. They have seen thy goings, O God, 
goings of my God, my King, in the sanctuary. Singers have been before, behind, are, players on instruments, in the midst virgins playing with timbrels. In assemblies bless ye God, the Lord from the fountain of Israel. There, is, little Benjamin their ruler, heads of Judah their defense, heads of Zebulun, heads of Naphtali. Thy God hath commanded thy strength, be strong, O God, this thou hast wrought for us. Because of thy temple at Jerusalem, to thee do kings bring a present. Rebuke a beast of the reeds, a company of bulls, with calves of the peoples, each humbling himself with pieces of silver, scatter thou peoples delighting in conflicts. Come do fat ones out of Egypt, Cush causeth her hands to run to God. Kingdoms of the earth, sing ye to God, praise ye the Lord. Selah. To him who is riding on the heavens of the heavens of old, lo, he giveth with his voice a strong voice. Ascribe ye strength to God, over Israel, is, his excellency, and his strength in the clouds. Fearful, O God, out of thy sanctuaries, the God of Israel himself, giving strength and might to the people. Blessed, is, God. Chapter 69 To the Overseer On the Lilies, by David Save me, O God, for come have waters unto the soul. I have sunk in deep mire, and there is no standing, I have come into the depths of the waters, and a flood hath overflown me. I have been wearied with my calling, burnt hath been my throat, consumed have been mine eyes, waiting for my God. Those hating me without cause have been more than the hairs of my head, mighty have been my destroyers, my lying enemies, that which I took not away, I bring back. O God, Thou, Thou hast known concerning my overturn, and my desolations from Thee have not been hid. Let not those waiting on Thee be ashamed because of me, O Lord, Jehovah of hosts, let not those seeking Thee blush because of me, O God of Israel. For because of Thee I have borne reproach, shame hath covered my face. A stranger I have been to my brother, and a foreigner to sons of my mother. For zeal for thy house hath consumed me, and the reproaches of thy reproachers have fallen upon me. And I weep in the fasting of my soul, and it is for a reproach to me. And I make my clothing sackcloth, and I am to them for a simile. Those sitting at the gate meditate concerning me, and those drinking strong drink, play on instruments. And I, my prayer, is, to thee, O Jehovah, a time of good pleasure, O God, in the abundance of thy kindness, answer me in the truth of thy salvation. Deliver me from the mire, and let me not sink, let me be delivered from those hating me, and from deep places of waters. Let not a flood of waters overflow me, nor let the deep swallow me up, nor let the pit shut her mouth upon me. Answer me, O Jehovah, for good, is, thy kindness, according to the abundance of thy mercies turn thou unto me. And hide not thy face from thy servant, for I am in distress, haste, answer me. Be near unto my soul, redeem it, because of mine enemies ransom me. Thou, thou hast known my reproach, and my shame, and my blushing, before thee, are, all mine adversaries. Reproach hath broken my heart, and I am sick, and I look for a bemoaner, and there is none, and for comforters, and I have found none. And they give for my food gall, and for my thirst cause me to drink vinegar. Their table before them is for a snare, and for a recompense, for a trap. Darkened are their eyes from seeing, and their loins continually shake thou. Pour upon them thine indignation, and the fierceness of thine anger doth seize them. Their tower is desolated, in their tents there is no dweller. For they have pursued him thou hast smitten, and recount of the pain of thy pierced ones. Give punishment for their iniquity, and they enter not into thy righteousness. They are blotted out of the book of life, and with the righteous are not written. And I, am, afflicted and pained, thy salvation, O God, doth set me on high. I praise the name of God with a song, and I magnify him with thanksgiving. And it is better to Jehovah than an ox, a bullock, horned, hoofed. The humble have seen, they rejoice, ye who seek God, and your heart liveth. For Jehovah hearkeneth unto the needy, and his bound ones he hath not despised. 
The heavens and earth do praise him, seas, and every moving thing in them. For God doth save Zion, and doth build the cities of Judah, and they have dwelt there, and possess it. And the seed of his servants inherit it, and those loving his name dwell in it. Chapter 70 To the Overseer, by David To cause to remember O God, to deliver me, O Jehovah, for my help, haste. Let them be ashamed and confounded who are seeking my soul, let them be turned backward and blush who are desiring my evil. Let them turn back because of their shame, who are saying, Aha, Aha. Let all those seeking thee joy and be glad in thee, and let those loving thy salvation say continually, God is magnified. And I, am, poor and needy, O God, haste to me, my help and my deliverer, art, thou, O Jehovah, tarry thou not. Chapter 71 in thee, O Jehovah, I have trusted, let me not be ashamed to the age. In thy righteousness thou dost deliver me, and dost cause me to escape, incline unto me thine ear, and save me. Be to me for a rock a habitation, to go in continually, thou hast given command to save me, for my rock and my bulwark, art, thou. O my God, cause me to escape from the hand of the wicked, from the hand of the perverse and violent. For thou, art, my hope, O Lord Jehovah, my trust from my youth. By thee I have been supported from the womb, from my mother's bowels thou dost cut me out, in thee, is, my praise continually. As a wonder I have been to many, and thou, art, my strong refuge. Filled is my mouth, with, thy praise, all the day, with, thy beauty. Cast me not off at the time of old age, according to the consumption of my power forsake me not. For mine enemies have spoken against me, and those watching my soul have taken counsel together. Saying, God hath forsaken him, pursue and catch him, for there is no deliverer. O God, be not far from me, O my God, for my help make haste. They are ashamed, they are consumed, who are opposing my soul, they are covered, with, reproach and blushing, who are seeking my evil. And I continually do wait with hope, and have added unto all thy praise. My mouth recounteth thy righteousness, all the day thy salvation, for I have not known the numbers. I come in the might of the Lord Jehovah, I mention thy righteousness, thine only. God, thou hast taught me from my youth, and hitherto I declare thy wonders. And also unto old age and gray hairs, O God, Forsake me not, till I declare thy strength to a generation, to every one that cometh thy might. And thy righteousness, O God, is, unto the heights, because thou hast done great things, O God, who, is, like thee? Because thou hast showed me many and sad distresses, thou turnest back, thou revivest me, and from the depths of the earth, thou turnest back, thou bringest me up. Thou dost increase my greatness, and thou surroundest, thou comfortest me. I also thank thee with a vessel of psaltery, thy truth, O my God, I sing to thee with a harp, O Holy One of Israel. My lips cry aloud when I sing praise to thee, and my soul that thou hast redeemed. My tongue also all the day uttereth thy righteousness, because ashamed because confounded, have been those seeking my evil. Chapter 72 By Solomon O God, thy judgments to the king give, and thy righteousness to the king's son. He judgeth thy people with righteousness, and thy poor with judgment. The mountains bear peace to the people, and the heights by righteousness. He judgeth the poor of the people, giveth deliverance to the sons of the needy, and bruiseth the oppressor. They fear thee with the sun, and before the moon, generation, generations. He cometh down as rain on mown grass, as showers, sprinkling the earth. Flourish in his days doth the righteous, and abundance of peace till the moon is not. And he ruleth from sea unto sea, and from the river unto the ends of earth. Before him bow do the inhabitants of the dry places, and his enemies lick the dust. Kings of Tarshish and of the isles send back a present. Kings of Sheba and Saba a reward bring near. And all kings do bow themselves to him, all nations do serve him. For he delivereth the needy who creeth, 
and the poor when he hath no helper. He hath pity on the poor and needy, and the souls of the needy he saveth. From fraud and from violence he redeemeth their soul, and precious is their blood in his eyes. And he liveth, and giveth to him of the gold of Sheba, and prayeth for him continually, all the day he doth bless him. There is a handful of corn in the earth, on the top of mountains, shake like Lebanon doth its fruit, and they flourish out of the city as the herb of the earth. His name is to the age, before the sun is his name continued, and they bless themselves in him, all nations do pronounce him happy. Blessed is Jehovah God, God of Israel, he alone is doing wonders. And blessed, is, the name of his honor to the age, and the whole earth is filled, with, his honor. Amen, and Amen. The prayers of David son of Jesse have been ended. Chapter 73 A Psalm of Azaph Only, good to Israel, is, God, to the clean of heart. And I, as a little thing, my feet have been turned aside. As nothing, have my steps slipped, for I have been envious of the boastful. The peace of the wicked I see, that there are no bands at their death. And their might, is, firm. In the misery of mortals they are not, and with common men they are not plagued. Therefore hath pride encircled them, violence covereth them as a dress. There I hath come out from fat. The imaginations of the heart transgressed. They do corruptly, and they speak in the wickedness of oppression, from on high they speak. They have set in the heavens their mouth, and their tongue walketh in the earth. Therefore do his people return hither, and waters of fullness are wrung out to them. And they have said, How hath God known? And is there knowledge in the Most High? Lo, these, are, the wicked and easy ones of the age, they have increased strength. Only, a vain thing. I have purified my heart, and I wash in innocency my hands. And I am plagued all the day, and my reproof, is, every morning. If I have said, I recount thus, lo, a generation of thy sons I have deceived. And I think to know this, perverseness it, is, in mine eyes. Till I come into the sanctuaries of God, I attend to their latter end. Only, in slippery places thou dost set them, thou hast caused them to fall to desolations. How have they become a desolation as in a moment, they have been ended, consumed from terrors. As a dream from awakening, O Lord, in awaking, their image thou despisest. For my heart doth show itself violent, and my reins prick themselves. And I am brutish, and do not know. A beast I have been with thee. And I, am, continually with thee, thou hast laid hold on my right hand. With thy counsel thou dost lead me, and after honor dost receive me. Whom have I in the heavens? And with thee none I have desired in earth. Consumed hath been my flesh and my heart, the rock of my heart and my portion, is, God to the age. For, lo, those far from thee do perish, thou hast cut off every one, who is going a-whoring from thee. And I, nearness of God to me, is, good, I have placed in the Lord Jehovah my refuge, to recount all thy works. Chapter 74 An Instruction of Azaph Why, O God, hast thou cast off for ever? Thine anger smoketh against the flock of thy pasture. Remember thy company. Thou didst purchase of old, thou didst redeem the rod of thy inheritance, this Mount Zion, thou didst dwell in it. Lift up thy steps to the perpetual desolations, everything the enemy did wickedly in the sanctuary. Roared have thine adversaries, in the midst of thy meeting places, they have set their ensigns as ensigns. He is known as one bringing in on high against a thicket of wood axes. And now, its carvings together with axe and hatchet they break down. They have sent into fire thy sanctuary, to the earth they polluted the tabernacle of thy name. They said in their hearts, Let us oppress them together, they did burn all the meeting places of God in the land. Our ensigns we have not seen, there is no more a prophet, nor with us is one knowing how long. Till when, O God, doth an adversary reproach? Doth an enemy despise thy name for ever? 
Why dost thou turn back thy hand, even thy right hand? From the midst of thy bosom remove, it. And God, is, my King of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. Thou hast broken by thy strength a sea dash, monster, thou hast shivered heads of dragons by the waters. Thou hast broken the heads of Leviathan, thou makest him food, for the people of the dry places. Thou hast cleaved a fountain and a stream, thou hast dried up perennial flowings. Thine, is, the day, also thine, is, the night, thou hast prepared a light giver, the sun. Thou hast set up all the borders of earth, summer and winter thou hast formed them. Remember this, an enemy reproached Jehovah, and a foolish people have despised thy name. Give not up to a company, the soul of thy turtle dove, the company of thy poor ones forget not for ever. Look attentively to the covenant, for the dark places of earth, have been full of habitations of violence. Let not the oppressed turn back ashamed, let the poor and needy praise thy name. Arise, O God, plead thy plea, remember thy reproach from a fool all the day. Forget not the voice of thine adversaries, the noise of thy withstanders is going up continually. Chapter 75 To the Overseer Destroy not. A Psalm of Azaph A Song We have given thanks to thee, O God, we have given thanks, and near, is, thy name, they have recounted thy wonders. When I receive an appointment, I, I do judge uprightly. Melted is the earth and all its inhabitants, I, I have pondered its pillars. Selah. I have said to the boastful, Be not boastful, and to the wicked, Raise not up a horn. Raise not up on high your horn, ye speak with a stiff neck. For not from the east, or from the west, nor from the wilderness, is, elevation. But God, is, judge, this he mocketh low and this he lifteth up. For a cup, is, in the hand of Jehovah, and the wine hath foamed, it is full of mixture, and he poureth out of it, only its dregs ring out, and drink, do all the wicked of the earth. And I, I declare, it, to the age, I sing praise to the God of Jacob. And all horns of the wicked I cut off, exalted are the horns of the righteous. Chapter 76 To the Overseer with Stringed Instruments A Psalm of Azaph A Song In Judah, is, God known, in Israel his name, is, great. And his tabernacle is in Salem, and his habitation in Zion. There he hath shivered arrows of a bow, shield, and sword, and battle. Selah. Bright, art, thou, honorable above hills of prey. Spoiled themselves have the mighty of heart, they have slept their sleep, and none of the men of might found their hands. From thy rebuke, O God of Jacob, both rider and horse have been fast asleep. Thou, fearful, art, thou, and who doth stand before thee, since thou hast been angry. From heaven thou hast sounded judgment, earth hath feared, and hath been still. In the rising of God to judgment, to save all the humble of earth. Selah. For the fierceness of man praiseth thee, the remnant of fierceness thou girdest on. Vow and complete to Jehovah your God, all ye surrounding him. They bring presents to the fearful one. He doth gather the spirit of leaders, fearful to the kings of earth. Chapter 77 To the Overseer, for Jeduthun. A Psalm of Azaph My voice, is, to God, and I cry, my voice, is, to God, and he hath given ear unto me. In a day of my distress the Lord I sought, my hand by night hath been spread out, and it doth not cease, my soul hath refused to be comforted. I remember God, and make a noise, I meditate, and feeble is my spirit. Selah. Thou hast taken hold of the watches of mine eyes, I have been moved, and I speak not. I have reckoned the days of old, the years of the ages. I remember my music in the night, with my heart I meditate, and my spirit doth search diligently. To the ages doth the Lord cast off? Doth he add to be pleased no more? Hath his kindness ceased forever? The saying failed to all generations? 
Hath God forgotten, his, favors? Hath he shut up in anger his mercies? Selah. And I say, my weakness is, the changes of the right hand of the Most High. I mention the doings of Jah, for I remember of old thy wonders. And I have meditated on all thy working, and I talk concerning thy doings. O God, in holiness, is, thy way, who, is, a great God like God? Thou, art, the God doing wonders. Thou hast made known among the peoples thy strength. Thou hast redeemed with strength thy people, the sons of Jacob and Joseph. Selah. The waters have seen thee, O God, the waters have seen thee, they are afraid, also depths are troubled. Poured out waters have thick clouds, the skies have given forth a noise, also, thine arrows go up and down. The voice of thy thunder, is, in the spheres, lightnings have lightened the world, the earth hath trembled, yea, it shaketh. In the sea, is, thy way, and thy paths, are, in many waters, and thy tracks have not been known. Thou hast led as a flock thy people, by the hand of Moses and Aaron. Chapter 78 An Instruction of Azaf Give ear, O my people, to my law, incline your ear to sayings of my mouth. I open with a simile my mouth, I bring forth hidden things of old. That we have heard and do know, and our fathers have recounted to us. We do not hide from their sons, to a later generation recounting praises of Jehovah, and his strength, and his wonders that he hath done. And he riseth up a testimony in Jacob, and a law hath placed in Israel, that he commanded our fathers, to make them known to their sons. So that a later generation doth know, sons who are born, do rise and recount to their sons. And place in God their confidence, and forget not the doings of God, but keep his commands. And they are not like their fathers, a generation apostate and rebellious, a generation. It hath not prepared its heart, nor steadfast with God, is, its spirit. Sons of Ephraim armed bearers of bow, have turned in a day of conflict. They have not kept the covenant of God, and in his law they have refused to walk. And they forget his doings, and his wonders that he shewed them. Before their fathers he hath done wonders, in the land of Egypt the field of Zoan. He cleft a sea, and causeth them to pass over, yea, he causeth waters to stand as a heap. And letteth them with a cloud by day, and all the night with a light of fire. He cleaveth rocks in a wilderness, and giveth drink as the great deep. And bringeth out streams from a rock, and causeth waters to come down as rivers. And they add still to sin against him, to provoke the Most High in the dry place. And they try God in their heart, to ask food for their lust. And they speak against God, they said, Is God able to array a table in a wilderness? Lo, he hath smitten a rock, and waters flow, yea, streams overflow. Also, bread, is, he able to give? Doth he prepare flesh for his people? Therefore hath Jehovah heard, and he sheweth himself wroth, and fire hath been kindled against Jacob, and anger also hath gone up against Israel. For they have not believed in God, nor have they trusted in his salvation. And he common death clouds from above, yea, doors of the heavens he hath opened. And he reigneth on the manna to eat, yea, corn of heaven he hath given to them. Food of the mighty hath each eaten, venison he sent to them to satiety. He causeth an east wind to journey in the heavens, and letteth by his strength a south wind. And he reigneth on them flesh as dust, and as sand of the seas, winged fowl. And causeth, it, to fall in the midst of his camp, round about his tabernacles. And they eat, and are greatly satisfied, and their desire he bringeth to them. They have not been estranged from their desire, yet, is, their food in their mouth. And the anger of God hath gone up against them, and he slayeth among their fat ones, and youths of Israel he caused to bend. With all this they have sinned again, and have not believed in his wonders. And he consumeth in vanity their days, and their years in trouble. If he slew them, then they sought him, and turned back, and sought God earnestly. And they remember that God, is, their rock, 
and God Most High their Redeemer. And, they deceive him with their mouth, and with their tongue do lie to him. And their heart hath not been right with him, and they have not been steadfast in his covenant. And he, the merciful one, pardoneth iniquity, and destroyeth not, and hath often turned back his anger, and waketh not up all his fury. And he remembereth that they, are, flesh, a wind going on and it returneth not. How often do they provoke him in the wilderness, grieve him in the desolate place? Yeah, they turn back, and try God, and the Holy One of Israel have limited. They have not remembered his hand the day he ransomed them from the adversary. When he set his signs in Egypt, and his wonders in the field of Zoan. And he turneth to blood their streams, and their floods they drink not. He sendeth among them the beetle, and it consumeth them, and the frog, and it destroyeth them. And giveth to the caterpillar their increase, and their labor to the locust. He destroyeth with hail their vine, and their sycamores with frost. And delivereth up to the hail their beasts, and their cattle to the burning flames. He sendeth on them the fury of his anger, wrath, and indignation, and distress, a discharge of evil messengers. He pondereth a path for his anger, he kept not back their soul from death, yea, their life to the pestilence he delivered up. And he smitteth every firstborn in Egypt, the firstfruit of the strong in tents of Ham. And causeth his people to journey as a flock, and guideth them as a drove in a wilderness. And he leadeth them confidently, and they have not been afraid, and their enemies hath the sea covered. And he bringeth them in unto the border of his sanctuary, this mountain his right hand had got. And casteth out nations from before them, and causeth them to fall in the line of inheritance, and causeth the tribes of Israel to dwell in their tents. And they tempt and provoke God Most High, and his testimonies have not kept. And they turn back, and deal treacherously like their fathers, they have been turned like a deceitful bow. And make him angry with their high places, and with their graven images make him zealous. God hath heard, and sheweth himself wroth. And kicketh exceedingly against Israel. And he leaveth the tabernacle of Shiloh, the tent he had placed among men. And he giveth his strength to captivity, and his beauty into the hand of an adversary. And delivereth up to the sword his people, and with his inheritance shewed himself angry. His young men hath fire consumed, and his virgins have not been praised. His priests by the sword have fallen, and their widows weep not. And the Lord waketh as a sleeper, as a mighty one crying aloud from wine. And he smitteth his adversaries backward, a reproach age during he hath put on them. And he kicketh against the tent of Joseph, and on the tribe of Ephraim hath not fixed. And he chooseth the tribe of Judah, with Mount Zion that he loved. And buildeth his sanctuary as a high place, like the earth, he founded it to the age. And he fixeth on David his servant, and taketh him from the folds of a flock. From behind suckling ones he hath brought him in, to rule over Jacob his people, and over Israel his inheritance. And he ruleth them according to the integrity of his heart, and by the skillfulness of his hands letteth them. Chapter 79 A Psalm of Azaph O God, nations have come into thy inheritance, they have defiled thy holy temple, they made Jerusalem become heaps. They gave the dead bodies of thy servants food for the fowls of the heavens, the flesh of thy saints for the wild beast of the earth. They have shed their blood as water round about Jerusalem, and there is none burying. We have been a reproach to our neighbors, a scorn and a derision to our surrounders. Till when, O Jehovah? Art thou angry for ever? Thy jealousy doth burn as fire. Pour thy fury on the nations who have not known thee, and on kingdoms that have not called in thy name. For, one, hath devoured Jacob, and his habitation they have made desolate. Remember not for us the iniquities of forefathers, haste, let thy mercies go before us, for we have been very weak. Help us, O God of our salvation, because of the honor of thy name, and deliver us, and cover over our sins, for thy name's sake. Why do the nations say, Where, is, their God? Let be known among the nations before our eyes, the vengeance of the blood of thy servants that is shed. 
Let the groaning of the prisoner come in before thee, according to the greatness of thine arm, leave thou the sons of death. And turn thou back to our neighbors, sevenfold unto their bosom, their reproach, wherewith they reproached thee, O Lord. And we, thy people, and the flock of thy pasture, we give thanks to thee to the age, to all generations we recount thy praise. Chapter 80 To the Overseer On the Lilies A Testimony of Azaph A Psalm Shepherd of Israel, give ear, leading Joseph as a flock, inhabiting the cherubs, shine forth. Before Ephraim, and Benjamin, and Manasseh, wake up thy might, and come for our salvation. O God, cause us to turn back, and cause thy face to shine, and we are saved. Jehovah, God of hosts, till when? Thou hast burned against the prayer of thy people. Thou hast caused them to eat bread of tears, and causest them to drink with tears a third time. Thou makest us a strife to our neighbors, and our enemies mock at it. God of hosts, turn us back, and cause thy face to shine, and we are saved. A vine out of Egypt thou dost bring, thou dost cast out nations, and plantest it. Thou hast looked before it, and dost root it, and it filleth the land. Covered have been hills, with, its shadow, and its boughs, are, cedars of God. It sendeth forth its branches unto the sea, and unto the river its sucklings. Why hast thou broken down its hedges, and all passing by the way have plucked it? A boar out of the forest doth waste it, and a wild beast of the fields consumeth it. God of hosts, turn back, we beseech thee, look from heaven, and see, and inspect this vine. And the root that thy right hand planted, and the branch thou madest strong for thee. Burnt with fire, cut down, from the rebuke of thy face they perish. Let thy hand be on the man of thy right hand, on the son of man thou hast strengthened for thyself. And we do not go back from thee, thou dost revive us, and in thy name we call. O Jehovah, God of hosts, turn us back, cause thy face to shine, and we are saved. Chapter 81 To the Overseer On the Giddeth By Azaph Cry aloud to God our strength, shout to the God of Jacob. Lift up a song, and give out a timbrel, a pleasant harp with psaltery. Blow in the month a trumpet, in the new moon, at the day of our festival. For a statute to Israel it, is, an ordinance of the God of Jacob. A testimony on Joseph he hath placed it, in his going forth over the land of Egypt. A lip, I have not known, I hear. From the burden his shoulder I turned aside, his hands from the basket pass over. In distress thou hast called and I deliver thee, I answer thee in the secret place of thunder, I try thee by the waters of Meribah. Selah. Hear, O my people, and I testify to thee, O Israel, if thou dost hearken to me. There is not in thee a strange God, and thou bowest not thyself to a strange God. I am Jehovah thy God, who bringeth thee up out of the land of Egypt. Enlarge thy mouth, and I fill it. But, my people hearkened not to my voice, and Israel hath not consented to me. And I send them away in the enmity of their heart, they walk in their own counsels. Oh that my people were hearkening to me, Israel in my ways would walk. As a little thing their enemies I cause to bow, and against their adversaries I turn back my hand. Those hating Jehovah feign obedience to him, but their time is, to the age. He causeth him to eat of the fat of wheat, and, with, Honey from a rock I satisfy thee. Chapter 82 A Psalm of Azaph God hath stood in the company of God, in the midst God doth judge. Till when do ye judge perversely? And the face of the wicked lift up? Selah. Judge ye the weak and fatherless, the afflicted and the poor declare righteous. Let the weak and needy escape, from the hand of the wicked deliver them. They knew not, nor do they understand, in darkness they walk habitually, moved are all the foundations of earth. I, I have said, gods ye, are, and sons of the Most High, all of you. But as man ye die, and as one of the heads ye fall. Rise, O God, judge the earth, 
for thou hast inheritance among all the nations. Chapter 83 A Song, A Psalm of Azaph O God, let there be no silence to thee, be not silent, nor be quiet, O God. For, lo, thine enemies do roar, and those hating thee have lifted up the head. Against thy people they take crafty counsel, and consult against thy hidden ones. They have said, Come, and we cut them off from, being, a nation, and the name of Israel is not remembered any more. For they consulted in heart together, against thee a covenant they make. Tents of Edom, and Ishmaelites, Moab, and the Hagarenes. Jebel, and Ammon, and Amalek, Philistia with inhabitants of Tyre. Ashur also is joined with them, they have been an arm to sons of Lot. Selah. Do to them as, to, Midian, as, to, Sisera, as, to, Jabin, at the stream Kishon. They were destroyed at Ender, they were dung for the ground. Make their nobles as Oreb and as Zeb, and as Zeba and Zalmunna all their princes. Who have said, Let us occupy for ourselves the comely places of God. O oh my God, make them as a rolling thing, as stubble before wind. As a fire doth burn a forest, and as a flame setteth hills on fire. So dost thou pursue them with thy whirlwind, and with thy hurricane troublest them. Fill their faces, with, shame, and they seek thy name, O Jehovah. They are ashamed and troubled for ever, yea, they are confounded and lost. And they know that thou, thy name, is, Jehovah, by thyself, art, the Most High over all the earth. Chapter 84 To the Overseer On the Giddeth by Sons of Korah A Psalm How beloved thy tabernacles, Jehovah of hosts! My soul desired, yea, it hath also been consumed, for the courts of Jehovah, my heart and my flesh cry aloud unto the living God. Even a sparrow hath found a house, and a swallow a nest for herself, where she hath placed her brood, thine altars, O Jehovah of hosts, my King and my God. O the happiness of those inhabiting thy house, yet do they praise thee. Selah. O the happiness of a man whose strength is in thee, highways, are, in their heart. Those passing through a valley of weeping, a fountain do make it, blessings also cover the director. They go from strength unto strength, he appeareth unto God in Zion. O Jehovah, God of hosts, hear my prayer, give ear, O God of Jacob. Selah. Our shield, see, O God, and behold the face of thine anointed. For good, is, a day in thy courts, O teacher. I have chosen rather to be at the threshold, in the house of my God, than to dwell in tents of wickedness. For a sun and a shield, is, Jehovah God, grace and honor doth Jehovah give. He withholdeth not good to those walking in uprightness. Jehovah of hosts. O oh, the happiness of a man trusting in thee. Chapter 85 To the Overseer By Sons of Korah A Psalm Thou hast accepted, O Jehovah, thy land, thou hast turned, to, the captivity of Jacob. Thou hast borne away the iniquity of thy people, thou hast covered all their sin. Selah. Thou hast gathered up all thy wrath, thou hast turned back from the fierceness of thine anger. Turn back, to, us, O God of our salvation, and make void thine anger with us. To the age art thou angry against us? Dost thou draw out thine anger to generation and generation? Dost thou not turn back? Thou revivest us, and thy people do rejoice in thee. Show us, O Jehovah, thy kindness, and thy salvation thou dost give to us. I hear what God Jehovah speaketh, for he speaketh peace unto his people, and unto his saints, and they turn not back to folly. Only, near to those fearing him, is, his salvation, that honor may dwell in our land. Kindness and truth have met, righteousness and peace have kissed. Truth from the earth springeth up, and righteousness from heaven looketh out. Jehovah also giveth that which is good, and our land doth give its increase. Righteousness before him goeth, 
and mocketh his footsteps for a way. Chapter 86 A Prayer of David Incline, O Jehovah, thine ear, answer me, for I, am, poor and needy. Keep my soul, for I, am, pious, save thy servant, who is trusting to thee, O thou, my God. Favor me, O Lord, for to thee I call all the day. Rejoice the soul of thy servant, for unto thee, O Lord, my soul I lift up. For thou, Lord, art, good and forgiving. And abundant in kindness to all calling thee. Hear, O Jehovah, my prayer, and attend to the voice of my supplications. In a day of my distress I call thee, for thou dost answer me. There is none like thee among the gods, O Lord, and like thy works there are none. All nations that thou hast made come and bow themselves before thee, O Lord, and give honor to thy name. For great, art, thou, and doing wonders, thou, art, God thyself alone. Show me, O Jehovah, thy way, I walk in thy truth, my heart doth rejoice to fear thy name. I confess thee, O Lord my God, with all my heart, and I honor thy name to the age. For thy kindness, is, great toward me, and thou hast delivered my soul from the lowest Sheol. O God, the proud have risen up against me, and a company of the terrible sought my soul, and have not placed thee before them. And thou, O Lord, art, God, merciful and gracious, slow to anger, and abundant in kindness and truth. Look unto me, and favor me, give thy strength to thy servant, and give salvation to a son of thine handmaid. Do with me a sign for good, and those hating me see and are ashamed, for thou, O Jehovah, hast helped me, yea, thou hast comforted me. Chapter 87 By Sons of Korah A Psalm, a Song His foundation, is, in holy mountains. Jehovah is loving the gates of Zion above all the tabernacles of Jacob. Honorable things are spoken in thee, O city of God. Selah I mention Rahab and Babel to those knowing me, Lo, Philistia, and Tyre, with Cush. This, one, was born there. And of Zion it is said, Each one was born in her, and he, the Most High, doth establish her. Jehovah doth recount in the describing of the peoples, This, one, was born there. Selah Singers also as players on instruments, all my fountains, are, in thee. Chapter 88 A Song, a Psalm, by Sons of Korah, to the Overseer, Concerning the Sickness of Afflictions An Instruction, by Heman the Ezrahite O Jehovah, God of my salvation, daily I have cried, nightly before thee. My prayer cometh in before thee, incline thine ear to my loud cry. For my soul hath been full of evils, and my life hath come to Sheol. I have been reckoned with those going down, to, the pit, I have been as a man without strength. Among the dead, free, as pierced ones lying in the grave, whom thou hast not remembered any more, yea, they by thy hand have been cut off. Thou hast put me in the lowest pit, in dark places, in depths. Upon me hath thy fury lain, and, with, all thy breakers thou hast afflicted. Selah. Thou hast put mine acquaintance far from me, thou hast made me an abomination to them, shut up, I go not forth. Mine I hath grieved because of affliction, I called thee, O Jehovah, all the day, I have spread out unto thee my hands. To the dead dost thou do wonders? Do Rephaim rise? Do they thank thee? Selah. Is thy kindness recounted in the grave? Thy faithfulness in destruction? Are thy wonders known in the darkness? And thy righteousness in the land of forgetfulness? And I, unto thee, O Jehovah, I have cried, and in the morning doth my prayer come before thee. Why, O Jehovah, castest thou off my soul? Thou hidest thy face from me. I am afflicted, and expiring from youth, I have borne thy terrors, I pine away. Over me hath thy wrath passed, thy terrors have cut me off. They have surrounded me as waters all the day, they have gone round against me together. 
Thou hast put far from me lover and friend, mine acquaintance, is, the place of darkness. Chapter 89 An Instruction, by Ethan the Ezraite Of the kind acts of Jehovah, to the age I sing, to all generations I make known thy faithfulness with my mouth. For I said, to the age is kindness built, the heavens. Thou dost establish thy faithfulness in them. I have made a covenant for my chosen, I have sworn to David my servant. Even to the age do I establish thy seed, and have built to generation and generation thy throne. Selah. And the heavens confess thy wonders, O Jehovah, thy faithfulness also, is, in an assembly of holy ones. For who in the sky, compareth himself to Jehovah? Is like to Jehovah among sons of the mighty? God is very terrible, in the secret counsel of his holy ones, and fearful over all surrounding him. O Jehovah, God of hosts, who, is, like thee, a strong jaw. And thy faithfulness, is, round about thee. Thou, art, ruler over the pride of the sea, in the lifting up of its billows thou dost restrain them. Thou hast bruised Rahab, as one wounded. With the arm of thy strength thou hast scattered thine enemies. Thine, are, the heavens, the earth also, is, thine, the habitable world and its fullness, thou hast founded them. North and south thou hast appointed them, Tabor and Hermon in thy name do sing. Thou hast an arm with might, strong is thy hand, high thy right hand. Righteousness and judgment, are, the fixed place of thy throne, kindness and truth go before thy face. O oh, the happiness of the people knowing the shout, O Jehovah, in the light of thy face they walk habitually. In thy name they rejoice all the day, and in thy righteousness they are exalted. For the beauty of their strength, art, thou, and in thy good will is our horn exalted. For of Jehovah, is, our shield, and of the Holy One of Israel our King. Then thou hast spoken in vision, to thy saint, yea, thou sayest, I have placed help upon a mighty one, exalted a chosen one out of the people. I have found David my servant, with my holy oil I have anointed him. With whom my hand is established, my arm also doth strengthen him. An enemy exacteth not upon him, and a son of perverseness afflicteth him not. And I have beaten down before him his adversaries, and those hating him I plague. And my faithfulness and kindness, are, with him, and in my name is his horn exalted. And I have set on the sea his hand, and on the rivers his right hand. He proclaimeth me, Thou, art, my Father, my God, and the rock of my salvation. I also firstborn do appoint him, highest of the kings of the earth. To the age I keep for him my kindness, and my covenant, is, steadfast with him. And I have set his seed for ever, and his throne as the days of the heavens. If his sons forsake my law, and in my judgments do not walk. If my statutes they pollute, and my commands do not keep. I have looked after with a rod their transgression, and with strokes their iniquity. And my kindness I break not from him, nor do I deal falsely in my faithfulness. I profane not my covenant, and that which is going forth from my lips I change not. Once I have sworn by my holiness, I lie not to David. His seed is to the age, and his throne, is, as the sun before me. As the moon it is established, to the age, and the witness in the sky is steadfast. Selah. And thou, thou hast cast off, and dost reject, thou hast shown thyself wroth with thine anointed. Hast rejected the covenant of thy servant, thou hast polluted to the earth his crown. Thou hast broken down all his hedges, thou hast made his fenced places a ruin. Spoiled him have all passing by the way, he hath been a reproach to his neighbors. Thou hast exalted the right hand of his adversaries, thou hast caused all his enemies to rejoice. Also, thou turnest back the sharpness of his sword, and hast not established him in battle. Hast caused, him, to cease from his brightness, and his throne to the earth hast cast down. Thou hast shortened the days of his youth, hast covered him over, with, shame. Selah. Till when, O Jehovah, art thou hidden?
Forever doth thy fury burn as fire? Remember, I pray thee, what, is, lifetime? Wherefore in vain hast thou created all the sons of men? Who, is, the man that liveth, and doth not see death? He delivereth his soul from the hand of Sheol. Selah. Where, are, thy former kindnesses, O Lord? Thou hast sworn to David in thy faithfulness. Remember, O Lord, the reproach of thy servants, I have borne in my bosom all the strivings of the peoples. Wherewith thine enemies reproached, O Jehovah, wherewith they have reproached the steps of thine anointed. Blessed, is, Jehovah to the age. Amen, and Amen. Chapter 90 A Prayer of Moses, the Man of God Lord, a habitation thou, thou hast been, to us, in generation and generation. Before mountains were brought forth, and thou dost form the earth and the world, even from age unto age thou, art, God. Thou turnest man unto a bruised thing, and sayest, Turn back, ye sons of men. For a thousand years in thine eyes, are, as yesterday, for it passeth on, yea, a watch by night. Thou hast inundated them, they are asleep, in the morning as grass he changeth. In the morning it flourisheth, and hath changed, at evening it is cut down, and hath withered. For we were consumed in thine anger, and in thy fury we have been troubled. Thou hast set our iniquities before thee, our hidden things at the light of thy face. For all our days pined away in thy wrath, we consumed our years as a meditation. Days of our years, in them, are, seventy years, and if, by reason of might, eighty years, yet, is, their enlargement labor and vanity, for it hath been cut off hastily, and we fly away. Who knoweth the power of thine anger? And according to thy fear, thy wrath? To number our days aright let, us, know, and we bring the heart to wisdom. Turn back, O Jehovah, till when? And repent concerning thy servants. Satisfy us at morn, with, thy kindness, and we sing and rejoice all our days. Cause us to rejoice according to the days wherein thou hast afflicted us, the years we have seen evil. Let thy work appear unto thy servants, and thine honor on their sons. And let the pleasantness of Jehovah our God be upon us, and the work of our hands establish on us, yea, the work of our hands establish it. Chapter 91 He who is dwelling in the secret place of the Most High, in the shade of the mighty lodgeth habitually. He is saying of Jehovah, my refuge, and my bulwark, my God, I trust in him. For he delivereth thee from the snare of a fowler, from a calamitous pestilence. With his pinion he covereth thee over, and under his wings thou dost trust, a shield and buckler, is, his truth. Thou art not afraid of fear by night, of arrow that fleeth by day. Of pestilence in thick darkness that walketh, of destruction that destroyeth at noon. There fall at thy side a thousand, and a myriad at thy right hand, unto thee it cometh not nigh. But with thine eyes thou lookest, and the reward of the wicked thou sayest. For thou, O Jehovah, art, my refuge, the Most High thou madest thy habitation. Evil happeneth not unto thee, and a plague cometh not near thy tent. For his messengers he chargeth for thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. On the hands they bear thee up, lest thou smite against a stone thy foot. On lion and asp thou treadest, thou trampest young lion and dragon. Because in me he hath delighted, I also deliver him, I set him on high, because he hath known my name. He doth call me, and I answer him, I, am, with him in distress, I deliver him, and honor him. With length of days I satisfy him, and I cause him to look on my salvation. Chapter 92 a Psalm. A Song for the Sabbath Day. Good to give thanks to Jehovah, and to sing praises to thy name, O Most High. To declare in the morning thy kindness, and thy faithfulness in the nights. On ten strings and on psaltery, on Hegean, with harp. For thou hast caused me to rejoice, O Jehovah, in thy work, concerning the works of thy hands I sing. How great have been thy works, O Jehovah, very deep have been thy thoughts. 
A brutish man doth not know, and a fool understandeth not this. When the wicked flourish as a herb, and blossom do all workers of iniquity for their being destroyed for ever and ever. And thou, art, high to the age, O Jehovah. For, lo, thine enemies, O Jehovah, for, lo, thine enemies, do perish, separate themselves do all workers of iniquity. And thou exaltest as a ream my horn, I have been anointed with fresh oil. And mine I looketh on mine enemies, of those rising up against me, the evil doers, do mine ears hear. The righteous as a palm tree flourish a, as a cedar in Lebanon he groweth. Those planted in the house of Jehovah, in the courts of our God do flourish. Still they bring forth in old age, fat and flourishing are they. To declare that upright, is, Jehovah my rock, and there is no perverseness in him. Chapter 93 Jehovah hath reigned, excellency he hath put on, Jehovah put on strength, he girded himself, also, established is the world, unmoved. Established is thy throne since then, from the age thou, art. Floods have lifted up, O Jehovah, floods have lifted up their voice, floods lift up their breakers. Then the voices of many mighty waters, breakers of a sea, mighty on high, is, Jehovah. Thy testimonies have been very steadfast, to thy house comely, is, holiness, O Jehovah, for length of days. Chapter 94 God of vengeance, Jehovah. God of vengeance, shine forth. Be lifted up, O judge of the earth, send back a recompense on the proud. Till when, do, the wicked, O Jehovah? Till when do the wicked exult? They utter, they speak an old saw, all working iniquity do boast themselves. Thy people, O Jehovah, they bruise, and thine inheritance they afflict. Widow and sojourner they slay, and fatherless ones they murder. And they say, Jehovah doth not see, and the God of Jacob doth not consider. Consider, ye brutish among the people, and ye foolish, when do ye act wisely? He who planteth the ear doth he not hear? He who fermeth the eye doth he not see? He who is instructing nations, doth he not reprove? He who is teaching man knowledge, is, Jehovah. He knoweth the thoughts of man, that they, are, vanity. O oh, the happiness of the man whom thou instructest, O Jah, and out of thy law teachest him. To give rest to him from days of evil, while a pit is digged for the wicked. For Jehovah leaveth not his people, and his inheritance forsaketh not. For to righteousness judgment turneth back, and after it all the upright of heart. Who riseth up for me with evil doers? Who stationeth himself for me with workers of iniquity? Unless Jehovah, were, a help to me, my soul had almost inhabited silence. If I have said, My foot hath slipped, thy kindness, O Jehovah, supporteth me. In the abundance of my thoughts within me, thy comforts delight my soul. Is a throne of mischief joined, with, thee? A framer of perverseness by statute? They decree against the soul of the righteous, and innocent blood declare wicked. And Jehovah is for a high place to me, and my God, is, for a rock, my refuge. And turneth back on them their iniquity, and in their wickedness cutteth them off, Jehovah our God doth cut them off. Chapter 95 Come, we sing to Jehovah, we shout to the rock of our salvation. We come before his face with thanksgiving, with psalms we shout to him. For a great God, is, Jehovah, and a great King over all gods. In whose hand, are, the deep places of earth, and the strong places of hills, are, his. Whose is the sea, and he made it, and his hands formed the dry land. Come in, we bow ourselves, and we bend, we kneel before Jehovah our Maker. For he, is, our God, and we the people of his pasture, and the flock of his hand, today, if to his voice ye hearken. Harden not your heart as, in, Meribah, as, in, the day of Massa in the wilderness. Where your fathers have tried me, have proved me, yea, have seen my work. Forty years I am weary of the generation, and I say, a people erring in heart, they. 
and they have not known my ways. Where I swear in mine anger, if they come in unto my rest. Chapter 96 Sing to Jehovah a new song, sing to Jehovah all the earth. Sing to Jehovah, bless his name, proclaim from day to day his salvation. Declare among nations his honor, among all the peoples his wonders. For great, is, Jehovah, and praised greatly, fearful he, is, over all gods. For all the gods of the peoples, are, not, and Jehovah made the heavens. Honor and majesty, are, before him, strength and beauty in his sanctuary. Ascribe to Jehovah, O families of the peoples, ascribe to Jehovah honor and strength. Ascribe to Jehovah the honor of his name, lift up a present and come in to his courts. Bow yourselves to Jehovah, in the honor of holiness, be afraid of his presence, all the earth. Say among nations, Jehovah hath reigned, also, established is the world, unmoved, he judgeth the peoples in uprightness. The heavens joy, and the earth is joyful, the sea and its fullness roar. The field exulteth, and all that, is, in it, then sing do all trees of the forest. Before Jehovah, for he hath come, for he hath come to judge the earth. He judgeth the world in righteousness, and the peoples in his faithfulness. Chapter 97 Jehovah hath reigned, the earth is joyful, many isles rejoice. Cloud and darkness, are, round about him, righteousness and judgment the basis of his throne. Fire before him goeth, and burneth round about his adversaries. Lightened have his lightnings the world, the earth hath seen, and is pained. Hills, like wax, melted before Jehovah, before the Lord of all the earth. The heavens declared his righteousness, and all the peoples have seen his honor. Ashamed are all servants of a graven image, those boasting themselves in idols, bow yourselves to him, all ye gods. Zion hath heard and rejoiceth, and daughters of Judah are joyful, because of thy judgments, O Jehovah. For thou, Jehovah, art, most high over all the earth, greatly thou hast been exalted over all gods. Ye who love Jehovah, hate evil, he is keeping the souls of his saints, from the hand of the wicked he delivereth them. Light, is, sown for the righteous, and for the upright of heart, joy. Rejoice, ye righteous, in Jehovah, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. Chapter 98 A Psalm Sing ye to Jehovah a new song, for wonders he hath done, given salvation to him hath his right hand and his holy arm. Jehovah hath made known his salvation, before the eyes of the nations, he hath revealed his righteousness. He hath remembered his kindness, and his faithfulness to the house of Israel, all ends of earth have seen the salvation of our God. Shout to Jehovah, all the earth, break forth, and cry aloud, and sing. Sing to Jehovah with harp, with harp, and voice of praise. With trumpets, and voice of a cornet, shout ye before the King Jehovah. Roar doth the sea and its fullness, the world and the inhabitants in it. Floods clap hand, together hills cry aloud. Before Jehovah, for he hath come to judge the earth, he judgeth the world in righteousness, and the people in uprightness. Chapter 99 Jehovah hath reigned, peoples tremble, the inhabitant of the cherubs, the earth shaketh. Jehovah in Zion, is, great, and high he, is, over all the peoples. They praise thy name, great, and fearful, holy, it, is. And the strength of the king hath loved judgment, thou, thou hast established uprightness, judgment and righteousness in Jacob, thou, thou hast done. Exalt ye Jehovah our God, and bow yourselves at his footstool, holy, is, he. Moses and Aaron among his priests, and Samuel among those proclaiming his name. They are calling unto Jehovah, and he doth answer them. In a pillar of cloud he speaketh unto them, they have kept his testimonies, and the statute he hath given to them. O Jehovah, our God, thou hast afflicted them, a God forgiving thou hast been to them, and taking vengeance on their actions. Exalt ye Jehovah our God, and bow yourselves at his holy hill, for holy, is, Jehovah our God. 
Chapter 100 A Psalm of Thanksgiving Shout to Jehovah, all the earth. Serve Jehovah with joy, come before him with singing. Know that Jehovah he, is, God, he made us, and we are his, his people and the flock of his pasture. Enter ye his gates with thanksgiving, his courts with praise, give ye thanks to him, bless ye his name. For good, is, Jehovah, to the age his kindness, and to generation and generation his faithfulness. Chapter 101 A Psalm of David Kindness and judgment I sing, to thee, O Jehovah, I sing praise. I act wisely in a perfect way, when dost thou come in unto me? I walk habitually in the integrity of my heart, in the midst of my house. I set not before mine eyes a worthless thing, the work of those turning aside I have hated, it adhereth not to me. A perverse heart turneth aside from me, wickedness I know not. Whoso slandereth in secret his neighbor, him I cut off, the high of eyes and proud of heart, him I endure not. Mine eyes are on the faithful of the land, to dwell with me, whoso is walking in a perfect way, he serveth me. He dwelleth not in my house who is working deceit, whoso is speaking lies is not established before mine eyes. At morning I cut off all the wicked of the land, to cut off from the city of Jehovah all the workers of iniquity. Chapter 102 A prayer of the afflicted when he is feeble, and before Jehovah poureth out his plaint. O Jehovah, hear my prayer, yea, my cry to thee cometh. Hide not thou thy face from me, in a day of mine adversity, incline unto me thine ear, in the day I call, haste, answer me. For consumed in smoke have been my days, and my bones as a firebrand have burned. Smitten as the herb, and withered, is my heart, for I have forgotten to eat my bread. From the voice of my sighing hath my bone cleaved to my flesh. I have been like to a pelican of the wilderness, I have been as an owl of the dry places. I have watched, and I am as a bird alone on the roof. All the day mine enemies reproached me, those mad at me have sworn against me. Because ashes as bread I have eaten, and my drink with weeping have mingled. From thine indignation and thy wrath, for thou hast lifted me up, and dost cast me down. My days as a shadow, are, stretched out, and I, as the herb I am withered. And thou, O Jehovah, to the age abidest, and thy memorial to all generations. Thou, thou risest, thou pitiest Zion, for the time to favor her, for the appointed time hath come. For thy servants have been pleased with her stones, and her dust they favor. And nations fear the name of Jehovah, and all kings of the earth thine honor. For Jehovah hath builded Zion, he hath been seen in his honor. He turned unto the prayer of the destitute, and he hath not despised their prayer. This is written for a later generation, and the people created do praise Jah. For he hath looked from the high place of his sanctuary. Jehovah from heaven unto earth looked attentively. To hear the groan of the prisoner, to loose sons of death. To declare in Zion the name of Jehovah, and his praise in Jerusalem. In the peoples being gathered together, and the kingdoms, to serve Jehovah. He hath humbled in the way my power, he hath shortened my days. I say, my God, take me not up in the midst of my days, through all generations, are, thine years. Before time the earth thou didst found, and the work of thy hands, are, the heavens. They, they perish, and thou remainest, and all of them as a garment become old, as clothing thou changest them, and they are changed. And thou, art, the same, and thine years are not finished. The sons of thy servants do continue, and their seed before thee is established. Chapter 103 By David Bless, O my soul, Jehovah, and all my inward parts, his holy name. Bless, O my soul, Jehovah, and forget not all his benefits. Who is forgiving all thine iniquities, who is healing all thy diseases? Who is redeeming from destruction thy life, who is crowning thee, kindness and mercies? Who is satisfying with good thy desire, renew itself as an eagle doth thy youth? Jehovah is doing righteousness and judgments for all the oppressed. 
He mocketh known his ways to Moses, to the sons of Israel his acts. Merciful and gracious, is, Jehovah, slow to anger, and abundant in mercy. Not for ever doth he strive, nor to the age doth he watch. Not according to our sins hath he done to us, nor according to our iniquities hath he conferred benefits upon us. For, as the height of the heavens, is, above the earth, his kindness hath been mighty over those fearing him. As the distance of east from west he hath put far from us our transgressions. As a father hath mercy on sons, Jehovah hath mercy on those fearing him. For he hath known our frame, remembering that we, are, dust. Mortal man. As grass, are, his days, as a flower of the field so he flourishe. For a wind hath passed over it, and it is not, and its place doth not discern it any more. And the kindness of Jehovah, is, from age even unto age on those fearing him, and his righteousness to sons' sons. To those keeping his covenant, and to those remembering his precepts to do them. Jehovah in the heavens hath established his throne, and his kingdom over all hath ruled. Bless Jehovah, ye his messengers, mighty in power, doing his word, to hearken to the voice of his word. Bless Jehovah, all ye his hosts, his ministers, doing his pleasure. Bless Jehovah, all ye his works, in all places of his dominion. Bless, O my soul, Jehovah. Chapter 104 Bless, O my soul, Jehovah. Jehovah, my God, thou hast been very great, honor and majesty thou hast put on. Covering himself, with, light as a garment, stretching out the heavens as a curtain. Who is laying the beam of his upper chambers in the waters, who is making thick clouds his chariot, who is walking on wings of wind. Making his messengers, the winds, his ministers, the flaming fire. He hath founded earth on its bases, it is not moved to the age and for ever. The abyss. As with clothing thou hast covered it, above hills do waters stand. From thy rebuke they flee, from the voice of thy thunder haste away. They go up hills, they go down valleys, unto a place thou hast founded for them. A border thou hast set, they pass not over, they turn not back to cover the earth. Who is sending forth fountains in valleys, between hills they go on. They water every beast of the field, wild asses break their thirst. By them the fowl of the heavens doth dwell, from between the branches they give forth the voice. Watering hills from his upper chambers, from the fruit of thy works is the earth satisfied. Causing grass to spring up for cattle, and herb for the service of man, to bring forth bread from the earth. And wine, it rejoiceth the heart of man, to cause the face to shine from oil, and bread, the heart of man it supporteth. Satisfied, are, the trees of Jehovah, cedars of Lebanon that he hath planted. Where birds do make nests, the stork, the firs, are, her house. The high hills, are, for wild goats, rocks, are, a refuge for conies. He made the moon for seasons, the sun hath known his place of entrance. Thou settest darkness, and it is night, in it doth every beast of the forest creep. The young lions are roaring for prey, and to seek from God their food. The sun riseth, they are gathered, and in their dens they crouch. Man goeth forth to his work, and to his service, till evening. How many have been thy works, O Jehovah, all of them in wisdom thou hast made, full is the earth of thy possessions. This, the sea, great and broad of sides, there, are, moving things, innumerable, living creatures, small with great. There do ships go, Leviathan, that thou hast formed to play in it. All of them unto thee do look, to give their food in its season. Thou dost give to them, they gather, thou dost open thy hand, they, are, satisfied, with, good. Thou hidest thy face, they are troubled, thou gatherest their spirit, they expire, and unto their dust they turn back. Thou sendest out thy spirit, they are created, and thou renewest the face of the ground. The honor of Jehovah is to the age, Jehovah rejoiceth in his works. Who is looking to earth, and it trembleth, he cometh against hills, and they smoke. 
I sing to Jehovah during my life, I sing praise to my God while I exist. Sweet is my meditation on him, I, I do rejoice in Jehovah. Consumed are sinners from the earth, and the wicked are no more. Bless, O my soul, Jehovah. Praise ye Jehovah. Chapter 105 Give ye thanks to Jehovah, call ye in his name, make known among the peoples his acts. Sing ye to him, sing praise to him, meditate ye on all his wonders. Boast yourselves in his holy name, the heart of those seeking Jehovah rejoiceth. Seek ye Jehovah and his strength, seek ye his face continually. Remember his wonders that he did, his signs and the judgments of his mouth. O seed of Abraham, his servant, O sons of Jacob, his chosen ones. He, is, Jehovah our God, in all the earth, are, his judgments. He hath remembered to the age his covenant, the word he commanded to a thousand generations. That he hath made with Abraham, and his oath to Isaac. And doth establish it to Jacob for a statute, to Israel a covenant age during. Saying, To thee I give the land of Canaan, the portion of your inheritance. In there being few in number, but a few, and sojourners in it. And they go up and down, from nation unto nation, from a kingdom unto another people. He hath not suffered any to oppress them and he reproveth for their sakes kings. Strike not against mine anointed, and to my prophets do not evil. And he calleth a famine on the land, the whole staff of bread he hath broken. He hath sent before them a man, for a servant hath Joseph been sold. They have afflicted with fetters his feet, iron hath entered his soul. Till the time of the coming of his word the saying of Jehovah hath tried him. The king hath sent, and looseth him, the ruler of the peoples, and draweth him out. He hath made him lord of his house, and ruler over all his possessions. To bind his chiefs at his pleasure, and his elders he mocketh wise. And Israel cometh into Egypt, and Jacob hath sojourned in the land of Ham. And he mocketh his people very fruitful, and mocketh it mightier than its adversaries. He turned their heart to hate his people, to conspire against his servants. He hath sent Moses his servant, Aaron whom he had fixed on. They have set among them the matters of his signs, and wonders in the land of Ham. He hath sent darkness, and it is dark, and they have not provoked his word. He hath turned their waters to blood, and putteth to death their fish. Teemed hath their land, with, frogs, in the inner chambers of their kings. He hath said, and the beetle cometh, lice into all their border. He hath made their showers hail, a flaming fire, is, in their land. And he smitteth their vine and their fig, and shivereth the trees of their border. He hath said, and the locust cometh, and the cankerworm innumerable. And it consumeth every herb in their land, and it consumeth the fruit of their ground. And he smitteth every firstborn in their land, the firstfruit of all their strength. And bringeth them out with silver and gold, and there is not in its tribes a feeble one. Rejoiced hath Egypt in their going forth, for their fear had fallen upon them. He hath spread a cloud for a covering, and fire to enlighten the night. They have asked, and he bringeth quails, and, with, bread of heaven satisfeeth them. He hath opened a rock, and waters issue, they have gone on in dry places, a river. For he hath remembered his holy word, with Abraham his servant. And he bringeth forth his people with joy, with singing his chosen ones. And he giveth to them the lands of nations, and the labor of peoples they possess. That they may observe his statutes, and his laws may keep. Praise ye Jehovah. Chapter 106 Praise ye Jah, give thanks to Jehovah, for good, for to the age, is, his kindness. Who doth utter the mighty acts of Jehovah? Soundeth all his praise? O oh, the happiness of those keeping judgment, doing righteousness at all times! Remember me, O Jehovah, with the favor of thy people, look after me in thy salvation. To look on the good of thy chosen ones, to rejoice in the joy of thy nation, to boast myself with thine inheritance. We have sinned with our fathers, we have done perversely, we have done wickedly. 
Our fathers in Egypt, have not considered wisely thy wonders, they have not remembered the abundance of thy kind acts, and provoke by the sea, at the sea of Suf. And he salveth them for his name's sake, to make known his might. And rebuketh the sea of Suf, and it is dried up, and causeth them to go through depths as a wilderness. And he salveth them from the hand of him who is hating, and redeemeth them from the hand of the enemy. And waters cover their adversaries, one of them hath not been left. And they believe in his words, they sing his praise. They have hasted, forgotten his works, they have not waited for his counsel. And they lust greatly in a wilderness, and try God in a desert. And he giveth to them their request, and sendeth leanness into their soul. And they are envious of Moses in the camp, of Aaron, Jehovah's Holy One. Earth openeth, and swalloweth up Dathan, and covereth over the company of Abram. And fire burneth among their company, a flame setteth on fire the wicked. They make a calf in Horeb, and bow themselves to a molten image. And change their honor into the form of an ox eating herbs. They have forgotten God their Savior, the doer of great things in Egypt. Of wonderful things in the land of Ham, of fearful things by the sea of Suf. And he saith to destroy them, unless Moses, his chosen one, had stood in the breach before him, to turn back his wrath from destroying. And they kick against the desirable land, they have not given credence to his word. And they murmur in their tents, they have not hearkened to the voice of Jehovah. And he lifteth up his hand to them, to cause them to fall in a wilderness. And to cause their seed to fall among nations, and to scatter them through lands. And they are coupled to Balpeor, and eat the sacrifices of the dead. And they provoke to anger by their actions, and a plague breaketh forth upon them. And Phinehas standeth, and executeth judgment, and the plague is restrained. And it is reckoned to him to righteousness, to all generations unto the age. And they cause wrath by the waters of Meribah, and it is evil to Moses for their sakes. For they have provoked his spirit, and he speaketh wrongfully with his Lee Psalm. They have not destroyed the peoples, as Jehovah had said to them. And mix themselves among nations, and learn their works. And serve their idols, and they are to them for a snare. And they sacrifice their sons and their daughters to destroyers. And they shed innocent blood, blood of their sons and of their daughters, whom they have sacrificed to idols of Canaan, and the land is profaned with blood. And they are defiled with their works, and commit whoredom in their habitual doings. And the anger of Jehovah is kindled against his people, and he doth abominate his inheritance. And giveth them into the hand of nations, and those hating them rule over them. And their enemies oppress them, and they are humbled under their hand. Many times he doth deliver them, and they rebel in their counsel, and they are brought low in their iniquity. And he looketh on their distress when he heareth their cry. And remembereth for them his covenant, and is comforted, according to the abundance of his kindness. And he appointeth them for mercies before all their captors. Save us, O Jehovah our God, and gather us from the nations, to give thanks to thy holy name, to glory in thy praise. Blessed, is, Jehovah, God of Israel, from the age even unto the age. And all the people said, Amen, praise Jah. Chapter 107 Give ye thanks to Jehovah, for good, for to the age, is, his kindness. Let the redeemed of Jehovah say, whom he redeemed from the hand of an adversary. And from the lands hath gathered them, from east and from west, from north, and from the sea. They wandered in a wilderness, in a desert by the way, a city of habitation they have not found. Hungry, yea, thirsty, their soul in them becometh feeble. And they cry unto Jehovah in their adversity, from their distress he delivereth them. And causeth them to tread in a right way, to go unto a city of habitation. They confess to Jehovah his kindness, and his wonders to the sons of men. For he hath satisfied a longing soul, and a hungry soul hath filled, with, goodness. Inhabitants of dark places and death shade, prisoners of affliction and of iron. Because they changed the saying of God, and the counsel of the Most High despised. 
and he humbleth with labor their heart, they have been feeble, and there is no helper. And they cry unto Jehovah in their adversity, from their distresses he saveth them. He bringeth them out from the dark place, and death shade, and their bands he draweth away. They confess to Jehovah his kindness, and his wonders to the sons of men. For he hath broken doors of brass, and bars of iron he hath cut. Fools, by means of their transgression, and by their iniquities, afflict themselves. All food doth their soul abominate, and they come nigh unto the gates of death. And cry unto Jehovah in their adversity, from their distresses he saveth them. He sendeth his word and healeth them, and delivereth from their destructions. They confess to Jehovah his kindness, and his wonders to the sons of men. And they sacrifice sacrifices of thanksgiving, and recount his works with singing. Those going down, to, the sea in ships, doing business in many waters. They have seen the works of Jehovah, and his wonders in the deep. And he saith, and appointeth a tempest, and it lifteth up its billows. They go up, to, the heavens, they go down, to, the depths, their soul in evil is melted. They reel to and fro, and move as a drunkard, and all their wisdom is swallowed up. And they cry to Jehovah in their adversity, and from their distresses he bringeth them out. He establisheth a whirlwind to a calm, and hushed are their billows. And they rejoice because they are quiet, and he leadeth them to the haven of their desire. They confess to Jehovah his kindness, and his wonders to the sons of men. And they exalt him in the assembly of the people, and in the seat of the elders praise him. He mocketh rivers become a wilderness, and fountains of waters become dry land. A fruitful land becometh a barren place, for the wickedness of its inhabitants. He mocketh a wilderness become a pool of water, and a dry land become fountains of waters. And he causeth the hungry to dwell there, and they prepare a city of habitation. And they sow fields, and plant vineyards, and they make fruits of increase. And he blesseth them, and they multiply exceedingly, and their cattle he doth not diminish. And they are diminished, and bow down, by restraint, evil, and sorrow. He is pouring contempt upon nobles, and causeth them to wander in vacancy no way. And setteth on high the needy from affliction, and placeth families as a flock. The upright do see and rejoice, and all perversity hath shut her mouth. Who, is, wise, and observeth these? They understand the kind acts of Jehovah. Chapter 108 A Psalm, A Psalm of David Prepared is my heart, O God, I sing, yea, I sing praise, also my honor. Awake, psaltery and harp, I awake the dawn. I thank thee among peoples, O Jehovah, and I praise thee among the nations. For great above the heavens, is, thy kindness, and unto the clouds thy truth. Be thou exalted above the heavens, O God, and above all the earth thy honor. That thy beloved ones may be delivered, save, with, thy right hand, and answer us. God hath spoken in his holiness, I exult, I apportion Shechem, and the valley of Sukkis I measure. Mine, is, Gilead, mine, is, Manasseh, and Ephraim, is, the strength of my head, Judah, is, my lawgiver. Moab, is, a pot for my washing, upon Edom I cast my shoe, over Philistia I shout habitually. Who doth bring me into the fenced city? Who hath led me unto Edom? Hast not thou, O God, cast us off? And thou goest not out, O God, with our hosts. Give to us help from adversity, and vain is the salvation of man. In God we do mightily, and he doth tread down our adversaries. Chapter 109 To the Overseer A Psalm of David O God of my praise, be not silent. For the mouth of wickedness, and the mouth of deceit, against me they have opened, they have spoken with me, a tongue of falsehood, and words of hatred. They have compassed me about, and they fight me without cause. For my love they oppose me, and I, prayer. And they set against me evil for good, and hatred for my love. 
Appoint thou over him the wicked, and an adversary standeth at his right hand. In his being judged, he goeth forth wicked, and his prayer is for sin. His days are few, his oversight another taketh. His sons are fatherless, and his wife a widow. And wander continually do his sons, yea, they have begged, and have sought out of their dry places. An exactor layeth a snare for all that he hath, and strangers spoil his labor. He hath none to extend kindness, nor is there one showing favor to his orphans. His posterity is for cutting off, in another generation is their name blotted out. The iniquity of his fathers is remembered unto Jehovah, and the sin of his mother is not blotted out. They are before Jehovah continually, and he cutteth off from earth their memorial. Because that he hath not remembered to do kindness, and pursueth the poor man and needy, and the smitten of heart, to slay. And he loveth reviling, and it meeteth him, and he hath not delighted in blessing, and it is far from him. And he putteth on reviling as his robe, and it cometh in as water into his midst, and as oil into his bones. It is to him as apparel, he covereth himself, and for a continual girdle he girdeth it on. This, is, the wage of mine accusers from Jehovah, and of those speaking evil against my soul. And thou, O Jehovah Lord, deal with me for thy name's sake, because thy kindness, is, good, deliver me. For I, am, poor and needy, and my heart hath been pierced in my midst. As a shadow when it is stretched out I have gone, I have been driven away as a locust. My knees have been feeble from fasting, and my flesh hath failed of fatness. And I, I have been a reproach to them, they see me, they shake their head. Help me, O Jehovah my God, save me, according to thy kindness. And they know that this, is, thy hand, thou, O Jehovah, thou hast done it. They revile, and thou dost bless, they have risen, and are ashamed, and thy servant doth rejoice. Mine accusers put on blushing, and are covered, as an upper robe, is, their shame. I thank Jehovah greatly with my mouth, and in the midst of many I praise him. For he standeth at the right hand of the needy, to save from those judging his soul. Chapter 110 A Psalm of David The affirmation of Jehovah to my Lord, sit at my right hand, till I make thine enemies thy footstool. The rod of thy strength doth Jehovah send from Zion, rule in the midst of thine enemies. Thy people, are, free will gifts in the day of thy strength, in the honors of holiness, from the womb, from the morning, thou hast the dew of thy youth. Jehovah hath sworn, and doth not repent, thou, art, a priest to the age, according to the order of Melchizedek. The Lord on thy right hand smote kings in the day of his anger. He doth judge among the nations, he hath completed the carcasses, hath smitten the head over the mighty earth. From a brook in the way he drinketh, therefore he doth lift up the head. Chapter 111 Praise ye Jah! I thank Jehovah with the whole heart, in the secret meeting of the upright, and of the company. Great, are, the works of Jehovah, sought out by all desiring them. Honorable and majestic is his work, and his righteousness is standing for ever. A memorial he hath made of his wonders, gracious and merciful, is, Jehovah. Pray he hath given to those fearing him, he remembereth to the age his covenant. The power of his works he hath declared to his people, to give to them the inheritance of nations. The works of his hands, are, true and just, steadfast, are, all his appointments. They are sustained for ever to the age. They are made in truth and uprightness. Redemption he hath sent to his people, he hath appointed to the age his covenant, holy, and fearful, is, his name. The beginning of wisdom, is, fear of Jehovah, good understanding have all doing them, his praise, is, standing for ever. Chapter 112 Praise ye Jah! O oh, the happiness of one fearing Jehovah, in his commands he hath delighted greatly. Mighty in the earth is his seed, the generation of the upright is blessed. Wealth and riches, are, in his house, and his righteousness is standing for ever. Light hath risen in darkness to the upright, gracious, 
and merciful, and righteous. Good is the man gracious and lending, he sustaineth his matters in judgment. For to the age he is not moved, for a memorial age during is the righteous. Of an evil report he is not afraid, prepared is his heart, confident in Jehovah. Sustained is his heart, he feareth not, till that he look on his adversaries. He hath scattered, hath given to the needy, his righteousness is standing for ever, his horn is exalted with honor. The wicked seeth, and hath been angry, his teeth he gnasheth, and hath melted, the desire of the wicked doth perish. Chapter 113 Praise ye Jah! Praise, ye servants of Jehovah! Praise the name of Jehovah! The name of Jehovah is blessed, from henceforth, and unto the age. From the rising of the sun unto its going in, praised, is, the name of Jehovah. High above all nations, is, Jehovah, above the heavens, is, his honor. Who, is, as Jehovah our God, he is exalting, himself, to sit. He is humbling, himself, to look on the heavens and on the earth. He is raising up from the dust the poor, from a dunghill he exalteth the needy. To cause to sit with princes, with the princes of his people. Causing the barren one of the house to sit, a joyful mother of sons, praise ye Jah. Chapter 114 In the going out of Israel from Egypt, the house of Jacob from a strange people. Judah became his sanctuary, Israel his dominion. The sea hath seen, and fleeth, the Jordan turneth backward. The mountains have skipped as rams, heights as sons of a flock. What, to thee, O sea, that thou fleest? O Jordan, thou turnest back. O mountains, ye skip as rams. O heights, as sons of a flock. From before the Lord be afraid, O earth, from before the God of Jacob. He is turning the rock to a pool of waters, the flint to a fountain of waters. Chapter 115 Not to us, O Jehovah, not to us, but to thy name give honor, for thy kindness, for thy truth. Why do the nations say, Where, pray, is, their God? And our God, is, in the heavens, all that he hath pleased he hath done. Their idols, are, silver and gold, work of man's hands. A mouth they have, and they speak not, eyes they have, and they see not. Ears they have, and they hear not, a nose they have, and they smell not. Their hands, but they handle not, their feet, and they walk not. Nor do they mutter through their throat, like them are their makers, every one who is trusting in them. O Israel, trust in Jehovah, their help and their shield, is, he. O house of Aaron, trust in Jehovah, their help and their shield, is, he. Ye fearing Jehovah, trust in Jehovah, their help and their shield, is, he. Jehovah hath remembered us, he blesseth, he blesseth the house of Israel, he blesseth the house of Aaron. He blesseth those fearing Jehovah, the small with the great. Jehovah addeth to you, to you, and to your sons. Blessed, are, ye of Jehovah, maker of heaven and earth. The heavens, the heavens, are, Jehovah's, and the earth he hath given to sons of men. The dead praise not Jah, nor any going down to silence. And we, we bless Jah, from henceforth, and unto the age. Praise ye Jah. Chapter 116 I have loved, because Jehovah heareth my voice, my supplication. Because he hath inclined his ear to me, and during my days I call. Compassed me have cords of death, and straits of Sheol have found me, distress and sorrow I find. And in the name of Jehovah I call, I pray thee, O Jehovah, deliver my soul. Gracious, is, Jehovah, and righteous, yea, our God, is, merciful. A preserver of the simple, is, Jehovah, I was low, and to me he giveth salvation. Turn back, O my soul, to thy rest, for Jehovah hath conferred benefits on thee. For thou hast delivered my soul from death, my eyes from tears, my feet from overthrowing. I walk habitually before Jehovah in the lands of the living. 
I have believed, for I speak, I, I have been afflicted greatly. I said in my haste, every man, is, a liar. What do I return to Jehovah? All his benefits, are, upon me. The cup of salvation I lift up, and in the name of Jehovah I call. My vows to Jehovah let me complete, I pray you, before all his people. Precious in the eyes of Jehovah, is, the death for his saints. Cause, it, to come, O Jehovah, for I, am, thy servant. I, am, thy servant, son of thy handmaid, thou hast opened my bonds. To thee I sacrifice a sacrifice of thanks, and in the name of Jehovah I call. My vows to Jehovah let me complete, I pray you, before all his people. In the courts of the house of Jehovah, in thy midst, O Jerusalem, praise ye Jah. Chapter 117 Praise Jehovah, all ye nations, glorify him, all ye peoples. For mighty to us hath been his kindness, and the truth of Jehovah, is, to the age. Praise ye Jah. Chapter 118 Give ye thanks to Jehovah, for good, for to the age, is, his kindness. I pray you, let Israel say, that, to the age, is, his kindness. I pray you, let the house of Aaron say, that, to the age, is, his kindness. I pray you, let those fearing Jehovah say, that, to the age, is, his kindness. From the straightness I called Jah, Jah answered me in a broad place. Jehovah, is, for me, I do not fear what man doth to me. Jehovah, is, for me among my helpers, and I, I look on those hating me. Better to take refuge in Jehovah than to trust in man. Better to take refuge in Jehovah, than to trust in princes. All nations have compassed me about, in the name of Jehovah I surely cut them off. They have compassed me about, yeah, they have compassed me about, in the name of Jehovah I surely cut them off. They compassed me about as bees, they have been extinguished as a fire of thorns, in the name of Jehovah I surely cut them off. Thou hast sorely thrust me to fall, and Jehovah hath helped me. My strength and song, is, Jah, and he is to me for salvation. A voice of singing and salvation, is, in the tents of the righteous, the right hand of Jehovah is doing valiantly. The right hand of Jehovah is exalted, the right hand of Jehovah is doing valiantly. I do not die, but live, and recount the works of Jah. Jah hath sorely chastened me, and to death hath not given me up. Open ye to me gates of righteousness, I enter into them, I thank Jah. This, is, the gate to Jehovah, the righteous enter into it. I thank thee, for thou hast answered me, and art to me for salvation. A stone the builders refused hath become head of a corner. From Jehovah hath this been, it, is, wonderful in our eyes. This, is, the day Jehovah hath made, we rejoice and are glad in it. I beseech thee, O Jehovah, save, I pray thee, I beseech thee, O Jehovah, prosper, I pray thee. Blessed, is, he who is coming in the name of Jehovah, we blessed you from the house of Jehovah. God, is, Jehovah, and he giveth to us light, direct ye the festal sacrifice with cords, unto the horns of the altar. My God thou, art, and I confess thee, my God, I exalt thee. Give ye thanks to Jehovah, for good, for to the age, is, his kindness. Chapter 119 Aleph Oh the happiness of those perfect in the way, they are walking in the law of Jehovah. Oh the happiness of those keeping his testimonies, with the whole heart they seek him. Yeah, they have not done iniquity, in his ways they have walked. Thou hast commanded us thy precepts to keep diligently. Oh that my ways were prepared to keep thy statutes. Then I am not ashamed in my looking unto all thy commands. I confess thee with uprightness of heart, in my learning the judgments of thy righteousness. Thy statutes I keep, leave me not utterly. Beth. With what doth a young man purify his path? To observe, according to thy word. With all my heart I have sought thee, let me not err from thy commands. In my heart I have hid thy saying, 
that I sin not before thee. Blessed, art, thou, O Jehovah, teach me thy statutes. With my lips I have recounted all the judgments of thy mouth. In the way of thy testimonies I have joyed, as over all wealth. In thy precepts I meditate, and I behold attentively thy paths. In thy statutes I delight myself, I do not forget thy word. Gimel. Confer benefits on thy servant, I live, and I keep thy word. Uncover mine eyes, and I behold wonders out of thy law. A sojourner I, am, on earth, hide not from me thy commands. Broken hath my soul for desire unto thy judgments at all times. Thou hast rebuked the cursed proud, who are erring from thy commands. Remove from me reproach and contempt, for thy testimonies I have kept. Princes also sat, against me they spoke, thy servant doth meditate in thy statutes. Thy testimonies also, are, my delight, the men of my counsel. Dulleth. Cleave to the dust hath my soul, quicken me according to thy word. My ways I have recounted, and thou answerest me, teach me thy statutes. The way of thy precepts cause me to understand, and I meditate in thy wonders. My soul hath dropped from affliction, establish me according to thy word. The way of falsehood turn aside from me and with thy law favor me. The way of faithfulness I have chosen, thy judgments I have compared. I have adhered to thy testimonies, O Jehovah, put me not to shame. The way of thy commands I run, for thou dost enlarge my heart. He. Show me, O Jehovah, the way of thy statutes, and I keep it, to, the end. Cause me to understand, and I keep thy law, and observe it with the whole heart. Cause me to tread in the path of thy commands, for in it I have delighted. Incline my heart unto thy testimonies, and not unto dishonest gain. Remove mine eyes from seeing vanity, in thy way quicken thou me. Establish to thy servant thy saying, that, is, concerning thy fear. Remove my reproach that I have feared, for thy judgments, are, good. Lo, I have longed for thy precepts, in thy righteousness quicken thou me. Vav. And meet me doth thy kindness, O Jehovah, thy salvation according to thy saying. And I answer him who is reproaching me a word, for I have trusted in thy word. And thou takest not utterly away from my mouth the word of truth, because for thy judgment I have hoped. And I keep thy law continually, to the age and for ever. And I walk habitually in a broad place, for thy precepts I have sought. And I speak of thy testimonies before kings, and I am not ashamed. And I delight myself in thy commands, that I have loved. And I lift up my hands unto thy commands, that I have loved, and I do meditate on thy statutes. Zane. Remember the word to thy servant, on which thou hast caused me to hope. This, is, my comfort in mine affliction, that thy saying hath quickened me. The proud have utterly scorned me, from thy law I have not turned aside. I remembered thy judgments of old, O Jehovah, and I comfort myself. Horror hath seized me, because of the wicked forsaking thy law. Songs have been to me thy statutes, in the house of my sojournings. I have remembered in the night thy name, O Jehovah, and I do keep thy law. This hath been to me, that thy precepts I have kept. Cheth. My portion, is, Jehovah, I have said, to keep thy words. I appease thy face with the whole heart, favor me according to thy saying. I have reckoned my ways, and turned back my feet unto thy testimonies. I have made haste, and delayed not, to keep thy commands. Cords of the wicked have surrounded me, thy law I have not forgotten. At midnight I rise to give thanks to thee, for the judgments of thy righteousness. A companion I, am, to all who fear thee, and to those keeping thy precepts. Of thy kindness, O Jehovah, the earth is full, thy statutes teach thou me. Taith. Good thou didst with thy servant, O Jehovah, according to thy word. The goodness of reason and knowledge teach me, for in thy commands I have believed. Before I am afflicted, I, I am erring, and now thy saying I have kept. Good thou, art, and doing good, 
teach me thy statutes. Forged against me falsehood have the proud, I with the whole heart keep thy precepts. Insensate as fat hath been their heart, I, in thy law I have delighted. Good for me that I have been afflicted, that I might learn thy statutes. Better to me, is, the law of thy mouth than thousands of gold and silver. Yod. Thy hands made me and establish me, cause me to understand, and I learn thy commands. Those fearing thee see me and rejoice, because for thy word I have hoped. I have known, O Jehovah, that righteous, are, thy judgments, and, in, faithfulness thou hast afflicted me. Let, I pray thee, thy kindness be to comfort me, according to thy saying to thy servant. Meet me do thy mercies, and I live, for thy law, is, my delight. Ashamed are the proud, for, with, falsehood they dealt perversely with me. I meditate in thy precepts. Those fearing thee turn back to me, and those knowing thy testimonies. My heart is perfect in thy statutes, so that I am not ashamed. Cough. Consumed for thy salvation hath been my soul, for thy word I have hoped. Consumed have been mine eyes for thy word, saying, When doth it comfort me? For I have been as a bottle in smoke, thy statutes I have not forgotten. How many, are, the days of thy servant? When dost thou execute against my pursuer's judgment? The proud have digged for me pits, that, are, not according to thy law. All thy commands, are, faithfulness, with, falsehood they have pursued me, help thou me. Almost consumed me on earth have they, and I, I have not forsaken thy precepts. According to thy kindness quicken thou me, and I keep the testimony of thy mouth. Lamed. To the age, O Jehovah, thy word is set up in the heavens. To all generations thy faithfulness, thou didst establish earth, and it standeth. According to thine ordinances they have stood this day, for the whole, are, thy servants. Unless thy law, were, my delights, then had I perished in mine affliction. To the age I forget not thy precepts, for by them thou hast quickened me. I, am, thine, save thou me, for thy precepts I have sought. Thy wicked waited for me to destroy me, thy testimonies I understand. Of all perfection I have seen an end, broad, is, thy command, exceedingly. Me am. Oh how I have loved thy law! All the day it, is, my meditation. Then mine enemies thy command mocketh me wiser, for it, is, before me to the age. Above all my teachers I have acted wisely. For thy testimonies, are, my meditation. Above elders I understand more, for thy precepts I have kept. From every evil path I restrain my feet, so that I keep thy word. From thy judgments I turned not aside, for thou, thou hast directed me. How sweet to my palate hath been thy saying, above honey to my mouth. From thy precepts I have understanding, therefore I have hated every false path. None. A lamp to my foot, is, thy word, and a light to my path. I have sworn, and I confirm, it, to keep the judgments of thy righteousness. I have been afflicted very much, O Jehovah, quicken me, according to thy word. Free will offerings of my mouth, accept, I pray thee, O Jehovah, and thy judgments teach thou me. My soul, is, in my hand continually, and thy law I have not forgotten. The wicked have laid a snare for me, and from thy precepts I wandered not. I have inherited thy testimonies to the age, for the joy of my heart, are, they. I have inclined my heart to do thy statutes, to the age, to, the end. Samek. Doubting ones I have hated, and thy law I have loved. My hiding place and my shield, art, thou, for thy word I have hoped. Turn aside from me, ye evildoers, and I keep the commands of my God. Sustain me according to thy saying, and I live, and thou puttiest me not to shame because of my hope. Support thou me, and I am saved, and I look on thy statutes continually. Thou hast trodden down all going astray from thy statutes, for falsehood, is, their deceit. Dross. 
Thou hast caused to cease all the wicked of the earth, therefore I have loved thy testimonies. Trembled from thy fear hath my flesh, and from thy judgments I have been afraid. Ein. I have done judgment and righteousness, leave me not to mine oppressors. Make sure thy servant for good, let not the proud oppress me. Mine eyes have been consumed for thy salvation. And for the saying of thy righteousness. Do with thy servant according to thy kindness. And thy statutes teach thou me. Thy servant, am, I, cause me to understand, and I know thy testimonies. Time for Jehovah to work. They have made void thy law. Therefore I have loved thy commands above gold even fine gold. Therefore all my appointments I have declared holy right, every path of falsehood I have hated. P.E. Wonderful, are, thy testimonies, therefore hath my soul kept them. The opening of thy words enlighteneth, instructing the simple. My mouth I have opened, yea, I pant, for, for thy commands I have longed. Look unto me, and favor me, as customary to those loving thy name. My steps establish by thy saying, and any iniquity doth not rule over me. Ransom me from the oppression of man, and I observe thy precepts. Thy face cause to shine on thy servant, and teach me thy statutes. Rivulets of waters have come down mine eyes, because they have not kept thy law. Sada. Righteous, art, thou, O Jehovah, and upright, are, thy judgments. Thou hast appointed thy testimonies, righteous and exceeding faithful. Cut me off hath my zeal, for mine adversaries forgot thy words. Tried, is, thy saying exceedingly, and thy servant hath loved it. Small I, am, and despised, thy precepts I have not forgotten. Thy righteousness, is, righteousness to the age, and thy law, is, truth. Adversity and distress have found me, thy commands, are, my delights. The righteousness of thy testimonies, is, to cause me to understand, and I live. Cough. I have called with the whole heart, answer me, O Jehovah, thy statutes I keep. I have called thee, save thou me, and I do keep thy testimonies. I have gone forward in the dawn, and I cry, for thy word I have hoped. Mine eyes have gone before the watches, to meditate in thy saying. My voice here, according to thy kindness, Jehovah, according to thy judgment quicken me. Near have been my wicked pursuers, from thy law they have been far off. Near, art, thou, O Jehovah, and all thy commands, are, truth. Of old I have known thy testimonies, that to the age thou hast founded them. Resh. See my affliction, and deliver thou me, for thy law I have not forgotten. Plead my plea, and redeem me, according to thy saying quicken me. Far from the wicked, is, salvation, for thy statutes they have not sought. Thy mercies, are, many, O Jehovah, according to thy judgments quicken me. Many, are, my pursuers, and adversaries, from thy testimonies I have not turned aside. I have seen treacherous ones, and grieve myself, because thy saying they have not kept. See, for thy precepts I have loved, Jehovah, according to thy kindness quicken me. The sum of thy word, is, truth, and to the age, is, every judgment of thy righteousness. Shin. Princes have pursued me without cause, and because of thy words was my heart afraid. I do rejoice concerning thy saying, as one finding abundant spoil. Falsehood I have hated, yea I abominate, it, thy law I have loved. Seven, times, in a day I have praised thee, because of the judgments of thy righteousness. Abundant peace have those loving thy law, and they have no stumbling block. I have waited for thy salvation, O Jehovah, and thy commands I have done. Kept hath my soul thy testimonies, and I do love them exceedingly. I have kept thy precepts and thy testimonies, for all my ways are before thee. Ta. My loud cry cometh near before thee, O Jehovah, according to thy word cause me to understand. My supplication cometh in before thee, according to thy saying deliver thou me. 
My lips do utter praise, for thou dost teach me thy statutes. My tongue doth sing of thy saying, for all thy commands, are, righteous. Thy hand is for a help to me, for thy commands I have chosen. I have longed for thy salvation, O Jehovah, and thy law, is, my delight. My soul liveth, and it doth praise thee, and thy judgments do help me. I wandered as a lost sheep, seek thy servant, for thy precepts I have not forgotten. Chapter 120 A Song of the Ascents Unto Jehovah in my distress I have called, and he answereth me. O Jehovah, deliver my soul from a lying lip, from a deceitful tongue. What doth he give to thee? And what doth he add to thee? O deceitful tongue! Sharp arrows of a mighty one, with broom coals. What to me, for I have inhabited Mezek, I have dwelt with tents of Kedar. Too much hath my soul dwelt with him who is hating peace. I am peace, and when I speak they are for war. Chapter 121 A Song of the Ascents I lift up mine eyes unto the hills, whence doth my help come? My help is from Jehovah, maker of heaven and earth. He suffereth not thy foot to be moved, thy preserver slumbereth not. Lo, he slumbereth not, nor sleepeth, he who is preserving Israel. Jehovah, is, thy preserver, Jehovah, is, thy shade on thy right hand. By day the sun doth not smite thee, nor the moon by night. Jehovah preserveth thee from all evil, he doth preserve thy soul. Jehovah preserveth thy going out and thy coming in, from henceforth even unto the age. Chapter 122 A Song of the Ascents, by David I have rejoiced in those saying to me, to the house of Jehovah we go. Our feet have been standing in thy gates, O Jerusalem. Jerusalem, the builded one, is, as a city that is joined to itself together. For thither have tribes gone up, tribes of Jah, companies of Israel, to give thanks to the name of Jehovah. For there have sat thrones of judgment, thrones of the house of David. Ask ye the peace of Jerusalem, at rest are those loving thee. Peace is in thy bulwark, rest in thy high places. For the sake of my brethren and my companions, let me speak, I pray thee, peace, be, in thee. For the sake of the house of Jehovah our God, I seek good for thee. Chapter 123 A Song of the Ascents Unto thee I have lifted up mine eyes, O dweller in the heavens. Lo, as eyes of men servants, are, unto the hand of their masters, as eyes of a maid servant, are, unto the hand of her mistress, so, are, our eyes unto Jehovah our God, till that he doth favor us. Favor us, O Jehovah, favor us, for greatly have we been filled with contempt. Greatly hath our soul been filled with the scorning of the easy ones, with the contempt of the arrogant. Chapter 124 A Song of the Ascents, by David Save, for, Jehovah, who hath been for us, pray, let Israel say. Save, for, Jehovah, who hath been for us, in the rising up of man against us. Then alive they had swallowed us up, in the burning of their anger against us. Then the waters had overflowed us, the stream passed over our soul. Then passed over our soul had the proud waters. Blessed, is, Jehovah who hath not given us, a prey to their teeth. Our soul as a bird hath escaped from a snare of fowlers, the snare was broken, and we have escaped. Our help, is, in the name of Jehovah, maker of the heavens and earth. Chapter 125 A Song of the Ascents Those trusting in Jehovah, are, as Mount Zion, it is not moved, to the age at Abadeth. Jerusalem Mountains, are, round about her, and Jehovah, is, round about his people, from henceforth even unto the age. For the rod of wickedness resteth not on the lot of the righteous, that the righteous put not forth on iniquity their hands. Do good, O Jehovah, to the good, and to the upright in their hearts. As to those turning, to, their crooked ways, Jehovah causeth them to go with workers of iniquity. Peace on Israel. 
Chapter 126 A Song of the Ascents In Jehovah's turning back, to, the captivity of Zion, we have been as dreamers. Then filled, with, laughter is our mouth, and our tongue, with, singing, then do they say among nations, Jehovah did great things with these. Jehovah did great things with us, we have been joyful. Turn again, O Jehovah, to, our captivity, as streams in the south. Those sowing in tears, with singing do reap. Whoso goeth on and weepeth, bearing the basket of seed, surely cometh in with singing, bearing his sheaves. Chapter 127 A Song of the Ascents, by Solomon If Jehovah doth not build the house, in vain have its builders labored at it, if Jehovah doth not watch a city, in vain hath a watchman waked. Vain for you who are rising early, who delay sitting, eating the bread of griefs, so he giveth to his beloved one sleep. Lo, an inheritance of Jehovah, are, sons, a reward, is, the fruit of the womb. As arrows in the hand of a mighty one, so, are, the sons of the young men. O oh, the happiness of the man who hath filled his quiver with them, they are not ashamed, for they speak with enemies in the gate. Chapter 128 A Song of the Ascents O oh, the happiness of every one fearing Jehovah, who is walking in his ways! The labor of thy hands thou surely eatest, happy, art, thou, and good, is, to thee. Thy wife, is, as a fruitful vine in the sides of thy house, thy sons as olive plants around thy table. Lo, surely thus is the man blessed who is fearing Jehovah. Jehovah doth bless thee out of Zion, look, then, on the good of Jerusalem, all the days of thy life. And see the sons of thy sons. Peace on Israel. Chapter 129 A Song of the Ascents Often they distressed me from my youth, pray, let Israel say. Often they distressed me from my youth, yet they have not prevailed over me. Over my back have plows plowed, they have made long their furrows. Jehovah, is, righteous, he hath cut asunder cords of the wicked. Confounded and turned backward do all hating Zion. They are as grass of the roofs, that before it was drawn out withereth. That hath not filled the hand of a reaper, and the bosom of a binder of sheaves. And the passers-by have not said, The blessing of Jehovah, is, on you, we blessed you in the name of Jehovah. Chapter 130 A Song of the Ascents From depths I have called thee, Jehovah. Lord, hearken to my voice, thine ears are attentive to the voice of my supplications. If iniquities thou dost observe, O Lord, who doth stand? But with thee, is, forgiveness that thou mayest be feared. I hoped, for, Jehovah, hoped hath my soul, and for his word I have waited. My soul, is, for the Lord, more than those watching for morning, watching for morning. Israel doth wait on Jehovah, for with Jehovah, is, kindness, and abundant with him, is, redemption. And he doth redeem Israel from all his iniquities. Chapter 131 a Song of the Ascents, by David. Jehovah, my heart hath not been haughty, nor have mine eyes been high, nor have I walked in great things, and in things too wonderful for me. Have I not compared, and kept silent my soul, as a weaned one by its mother? As a weaned one by me, is, my soul. Israel doth wait on Jehovah, from henceforth, and unto the age. Chapter 132 a Song of the Ascents. Remember, Jehovah, for David, all his afflictions. Who hath sworn to Jehovah? He hath vowed to the Mighty One of Jacob. If I enter into the tent of my house, if I go up on the couch of my bed. If I give sleep to mine eyes, to mine eyelids, slumber. Till I do find a place for Jehovah, tabernacles for the Mighty One of Jacob. Lo, we have heard it in Ephrata we have found it in the fields of the forest. We come into his tabernacles, we bow ourselves at his footstool. Arise, O Jehovah, to thy rest, thou, and the ark of thy strength. Thy priests do put on righteousness, and thy pious ones cry aloud. 
For the sake of David thy servant, turn not back the face of thine anointed. Jehovah hath sworn truth to David, he turneth not back from it, of the fruit of thy body, I set on the throne for thee. If thy sons keep my covenant, and my testimonies that I teach them, their sons also for ever and ever, do sit on the throne for thee. For Jehovah hath fixed on Zion, he hath desired, it, for a seat to himself. This, is, my rest for ever and ever, here do I sit, for I have desired it. Her provision I greatly bless, her needy ones I satisfy, with, bread. And her priests I clothe, with, salvation, and her pious ones do sing aloud. There I cause to spring up a horn for David, I have arranged a lamp for mine anointed. His enemies I do clothe, with, shame, and upon him doth his crown flourish. Chapter 133 A Song of the Ascents, by David Lo, how good and how pleasant the dwelling of brethren even together! As the good oil on the head, coming down on the beard, the beard of Aaron, that cometh down on the skirt of his robes. As dew of Hermon, that cometh down on hills of Zion, for there Jehovah commanded the blessing, Life unto the Age. Chapter 134 A Song of the Ascents Lo, bless Jehovah, all servants of Jehovah, who are standing in the house of Jehovah by night. Lift up your hands, in, the sanctuary, and bless ye Jehovah. Jehovah doth bless thee out of Zion, the maker of the heavens and earth. Chapter 135 Praise ye Jah. Praise ye the name of Jehovah, praise, ye servants of Jehovah, who are standing in the house of Jehovah, in the courts of the house of our God. Praise ye Jah. For Jehovah, is, good, sing praise to his name, for, it is, pleasant. For Jacob hath Jah chosen for himself, Israel for his peculiar treasure. For I have known that great, is, Jehovah, yea, our Lord, is, above all gods. All that Jehovah pleased he hath done, in the heavens and in earth, in the seas and all deep places. Causing vapors to ascend from the end of the earth, lightnings for the rain he hath made, bringing forth wind from his treasures. Who smote the firstborn of Egypt, from man unto beast. He sent tokens and wonders into thy midst, O Egypt, on Pharaoh and on all his servants. Who smote many nations, and slew strong kings. Even Sion king of the Amorite, and O.G. king of Bashan, and all kingdoms of Canaan. And he gave their land an inheritance, an inheritance to Israel his people. O Jehovah, thy name, is, to the age, O Jehovah, thy memorial to all generations. For Jehovah doth judge his people, and for his servants comforteth himself. The idols of the nations, are, silver and gold, work of the hands of man. A mouth they have, and they speak not, eyes they have, and they see not. Ears they have, and they give not ear, nose, there is no breath in their mouth. Like them are their makers, every one who is trusting in them. O house of Israel, bless ye Jehovah, O house of Aaron, bless ye Jehovah. O house of Levi, bless ye Jehovah, those fearing Jehovah, bless ye Jehovah. Blessed, is, Jehovah from Zion, inhabiting Jerusalem, praise ye Jah. Chapter 136 Give ye thanks to Jehovah, for good, for to the age, is, his kindness. Give ye thanks to the God of gods, for to the age, is, his kindness. Give ye thanks to the Lord of lords, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him doing great wonders by himself alone, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him making the heavens by understanding, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him spreading the earth over the waters, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him making great lights, for to the age, is, his kindness. The sun to rule by day, for to the age, is, his kindness. The moon and stars to rule by night, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him smiting Egypt in their firstborn, for to the age, is, his kindness. And bringing forth Israel from their midst, for to the age, is, his kindness. 
by a strong hand, and a stretched out arm, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him cutting the sea of suff into parts, for to the age, is, his kindness. And caused Israel to pass through its midst, for to the age, is, his kindness. And shook out Pharaoh and his force in the sea of suff, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him leading his people in a wilderness, for to the age, is, his kindness. To him smiting great kings, for to the age, is, his kindness. Yeah, he doth slay honorable kings, for to the age, is, his kindness. Even Sion king of the Amorite, for to the age, is, his kindness. And O.G. king of Bashan, for to the age, is, his kindness. And he gave their land for inheritance, for to the age, is, his kindness. An inheritance to Israel his servant, for to the age, is, his kindness. Who in our lowliness hath remembered us, for to the age, is, his kindness. And he delivereth us from our adversaries, for to the age, is, his kindness. Giving food to all flesh, for to the age, is, his kindness. Give ye thanks to the God of the heavens, for to the age, is, his kindness. Chapter 137 By rivers of Babylon, there we did sit, yea, we wept when we remembered Zion. On willows in its midst we hung our har psalm. For there our captors asked us the words of a song, and our spoilers, joy, sing ye to us of a song of Zion. How do we sing the song of Jehovah, on the land of a stranger? If I forget thee, O Jerusalem, my right hand forgetteth. My tongue doth cleave to my palate, if I do not remember thee, if I do not exalt Jerusalem above my chief joy. Remember, Jehovah, for the sons of Edom, the day of Jerusalem, those saying, Raise, raise to its foundation. O daughter of Babylon, O destroyed one, O the happiness of him who repayeth to thee thy deed, that thou hast done to us. O the happiness of him who doth seize, and hath dashed thy sucklings on the rock. Chapter 138 By David I confess thee, with all my heart, before the gods I do praise thee. I bow myself toward thy holy temple, and I confess thy name, for thy kindness, and for thy truth, for thou hast made great thy saying above all thy name. In the day I called, when thou dost answer me, thou dost strengthen me in my soul, with, strength. O Jehovah, all kings of earth confess thee, when they have heard the sayings of thy mouth. And they sing in the ways of Jehovah, for great, is, the honor of Jehovah. For high, is, Jehovah, and the lowly he seeth, and the haughty from afar he knoweth. If I walk in the midst of distress thou quickenest me, against the anger of mine enemies thou sendest forth thy hand, and thy right hand doth save me. Jehovah doth perfect for me, O Jehovah, thy kindness, is, to the age, the works of thy hands let not fall. Chapter 139 To the Overseer A Psalm by David Jehovah, thou hast searched me, and knowest. Thou, thou hast known my sitting down, and my rising up, thou hast attended to my thoughts from afar. My path and my couch thou hast fanned, and, with, all my ways hast been acquainted. For there is not a word in my tongue, lo, O Jehovah, thou hast known it all. Behind and before thou hast besieged me, and thou dost place on me thy hand. Knowledge too wonderful for me, it hath been set on high, I am not able for it. Whither do I go from thy spirit? And whither from thy face do I flee? If I ascend the heavens, there thou, art, and spread out a couch in Sheol, lo, thee. I take the wings of morning, I dwell in the uttermost part of the sea. Also there thy hand doth lead me, and thy right hand doth hold me. And I say, Surely darkness bruiseth me, then night, is, light to me. Also darkness hideth not from thee, and night as day shineth, as, is, darkness so, is, light. For thou, thou hast possessed my reins, thou dost cover me in my mother's belly. I confess thee, because that, with, wonders I have been distinguished. Wonderful, are, thy works, 
and my soul is knowing, it, well. My substance was not hid from thee, when I was made in secret, curiously wrought in the lower part of earth. Mine unformed substance thine eyes saw, and on thy book all of them are written, the days they were formed and not one among them. And to me how precious have been thy thoughts, O God, how great hath been their sum! I recount them. Then the sand they are more, I have waked, and I am still with thee. Dost thou slay, O God, the wicked? Then, men of blood, turn aside from me. Who exchange thee for wickedness, lifted up to vanity, are, thine enemies. Do not I hate, Jehovah, those hating thee? And with thy withstanders grieve myself? With, perfect hatred I have hated them, enemies they have become to me. Search me, O God, and know my heart, try me, and know my thoughts. And see if a grievous way be in me, and lead me in a way age during. Chapter 140 To the Overseer A Psalm of David Deliver me, O Jehovah, from an evil man, from one of violence thou keepest me. Who have devised evils in the heart, all the day they assemble, for, wars. They sharpen their tongue as a serpent, poison of an adder, is, under their lee psalm selah. Preserve me, Jehovah, from the hands of the wicked, from one of violence thou keepest me, who have devised to overthrow my st psalm. The proud hid a snare for me, and cords, they spread a net by the side of the path, snares they have set for me. Selah. I have said to Jehovah, my God, art, thou, here, Jehovah, the voice of my supplications. O Jehovah, my Lord, strength of my salvation, thou hast covered my head in the day of armor. Grant not, O Jehovah, the desires of the wicked, his wicked device bring not forth, they are high. Selah. The chief of my surrounders, the perverseness of their lips covereth them. They cause to fall on themselves burning coals, into fire he doth cast them, into deep pits, they arise not. A talkative man is not established in the earth, one of violence evil hunteth to overflowing. I have known that Jehovah doth execute the judgment of the afflicted, the judgment of the needy. Only, the righteous give thanks to thy name, the upright do dwell with thy presence. Chapter 141 A Psalm, by David O Jehovah, I have called thee, haste to me, give ear, to, my voice when I call to thee. My prayer is prepared, incense before thee, the lifting up of my hands, the evening present. Set, O Jehovah, a watch for my mouth, watch thou over the door of my lee psalm. Incline not my heart to an evil thing, to do habitually actions in wickedness, with men working iniquity, yea, I eat not of their pleasant things. The righteous doth beat me, in, kindness. And doth reprove me, oil of the head my head disalloweth not, for still my prayer, is, about their vexations. Their judges have been released by the sides of a rock, and they have heard my sayings, for they have been pleasant. As one tilling and ripping up in the land, have our bones been scattered at the command of Saul. But to thee, O Jehovah, my Lord, are, mine eyes, in thee I have trusted, make not bare my soul. Keep me from the gin they laid for me, even snares of workers of iniquity. The wicked fall in their nets together, till I pass over. Chapter 142 An Instruction of David, A Prayer When He Is in the Cave My voice, is, unto Jehovah, I cry, my voice, is, unto Jehovah, I entreat grace. I pour forth before him my meditation, my distress before him I declare. When my spirit hath been feeble in me, then thou hast known my path, in the way, in, which I walk, they have hid a snare for me. Looking on the right hand, and seeing, and I have none recognizing, perished hath refuge from me, there is none inquiring for my soul. I have cried unto thee, O Jehovah, I have said, Thou, art, my refuge, my portion in the land of the living. Attend thou unto my loud cry, for I have become very low, deliver thou me from my pursuers, for they have been stronger than I. Bring forth from prison my soul to confess thy name, the righteous do compass me about, when thou conferrest benefits upon me. 
Chapter 143 A Psalm of David O Jehovah, hear my prayer, give ear unto my supplications, in thy faithfulness answer me, in thy righteousness. And enter not into judgment with thy servant, for no one living is justified before thee. For an enemy hath pursued my soul, he hath bruised to the earth my life, he hath caused me to dwell in dark places, as the dead of old. And my spirit in me is become feeble, within me is my heart become desolate. I have remembered days of old, I have meditated on all thine acts, on the work of thy hand I muse. I have spread forth my hands unto thee, my soul, is, as a weary land for thee. Selah. Haste, answer me, O Jehovah, my spirit hath been consumed, hide not thou thy face from me, or I have been compared with those going down, to, the pit. Cause me to hear in the morning thy kindness, for in thee I have trusted, cause me to know the way that I go, for unto thee I have lifted up my soul. Deliver me from mine enemies, O Jehovah, near thee I am covered. Teach me to do thy good pleasure, for thou, art, my God, thy spirit, is, good, lead me into a land of uprightness. For thy name's sake, O Jehovah, thou dost quicken me, in thy righteousness, thou bringest out from distress my soul. And in thy kindness cuttest off mine enemies, and hast destroyed all the adversaries of my soul, for I am thy servant. Chapter 144 By David Blessed is Jehovah my rock, who is teaching my hands for war, my fingers for battle. My kind one, and my bulwark, my tower, and my deliverer, my shield, and in whom I have trusted, who is subduing my people under me. Jehovah, what, is, man that thou knowest him? Son of man, that thou esteemest him? Man to vanity hath been like, his days, are, as a shadow passing by. Jehovah, incline thy heavens and come down, strike against mountains, and they smoke. Send forth lightning, and scatter them, send forth thine arrows, and trouble them. Send forth thy hand from on high, free me, and deliver me from many waters, from the hand of sons of a stranger. Because their mouth hath spoken vanity, and their right hand, is, a right hand of falsehood. O God, a new song I sing to thee, on a psaltery of ten strings I sing praise to thee. Who is giving deliverance to kings, who is freeing David his servant from the sword of evil. Free me, and deliver me from the hand of sons of a stranger, because their mouth hath spoken vanity, and their right hand, is, a right hand of falsehood. Because our sons, are, as plants, becoming great in their youth, our daughters as hewn stones, polished, the likeness of a palace. Our garners, are, full, bringing out from kind to kind, our flocks are bringing four thousands, ten thousands in our outplaces. Our oxen are carrying, there is no breach, and there is no outgoing, and there is no crying in our broad places. Oh the happiness of the people that is thus, oh the happiness of the people whose God, is, Jehovah. Chapter 145 Praise by David I exalt thee, my God, O King, and bless thy name to the age and for ever. Every day do I bless thee, and praise thy name to the age and for ever. Great, is, Jehovah, and praised greatly, and of his greatness there is no searching. Generation to generation praiseth thy works, and thy mighty acts they declare. The honor, the glory of thy majesty, and the matters of thy wonders I declare. And the strength of thy fearful acts they tell, and thy greatness I recount. The memorial of the abundance of thy goodness they send forth. And thy righteousness they sing. Gracious and merciful, is, Jehovah, slow to anger, and great in kindness. Good, is, Jehovah to all, and his mercies, are, over all his works. Confess thee O Jehovah, do all thy works, and thy saints do bless thee. The honor of thy kingdom they tell, and, of, thy might they speak. To make known to sons of men his mighty acts, the honor of the majesty of his kingdom. Thy kingdom, is, a kingdom of all ages, and thy dominion, is, in all generations. Jehovah is supporting all who are falling, and raising up all who are bowed down. 
The eyes of all unto thee do look, and thou art giving to them their food in its season. Opening thy hand, and satisfying the desire of every living thing. Righteous, is, Jehovah in all his ways, and kind in all his works. Near, is, Jehovah to all those calling him, to all who call him in truth. The desire of those fearing him he doth, and their cry he heareth, and saveth them. Jehovah preserveth all those loving him, and all the wicked he destroyeth. The praise of Jehovah my mouth speaketh, and all flesh doth bless his holy name, to the age and for ever. Chapter 146 Praise ye Jah! Praise, O my soul, Jehovah! I praise Jehovah during my life, I sing praise to my God while I exist. Trust not in princes in a son of man, for he hath no deliverance. His spirit goeth forth, he returneth to his earth, in that day have his thoughts perished. O oh, the happiness of him who hath the God of Jacob for his help, his hope, is, on Jehovah his God. Making the heavens and earth, the sea, and all that, is, in them, who is keeping truth to the age. Doing judgment for the oppressed, giving bread to the hungry. Jehovah is loosing the prisoners, Jehovah is opening, the eyes of, the blind, Jehovah is raising the bowed down, Jehovah is loving the righteous. Jehovah is preserving the strangers, the fatherless and widow he causeth to stand, and the way of the wicked he turneth upside down. Jehovah doth reign to the age, thy God, O Zion, to generation and generation, praise ye Jah. Chapter 147 Praise ye Jah. For, it is, good to praise our God, for pleasant, comely, is, praise. Building Jerusalem, is, Jehovah, the driven away of Israel he gathereth. Who is giving healing to the broken of heart, and is binding up their griefs. Appointing the number of the stars, to all them he giveth names. Great, is, our Lord, and abundant in power, of his understanding there is no narration. Jehovah is causing the meek to stand, making low the wicked unto the earth. Answer ye to Jehovah with thanksgiving, sing ye to our God with a harp. Who is covering the heavens with clouds, who is preparing for the earth rain, who is causing grass to spring up, on, mountains. Giving to the beast its food, to the young of the ravens that call. Not in the might of the horse doth he delight, not in the legs of a man is he pleased. Jehovah is pleased with those fearing him, with those waiting for his kindness. Glorify, O Jerusalem, Jehovah, praise thy God, O Zion. For he did strengthen the bars of thy gates, he hath blessed thy sons in thy midst. Who is making thy border peace, with, the fat of wheat he satisfeeth thee. Who is sending forth his saying, on, earth, very speedily doth his word run. Who is giving snow like wool, hoarfrost as ashes he scattereth. Casting forth his ice like morsels, before his cold who doth stand. He sendeth forth his word and melteth them, he causeth his wind to blow, the waters flow. Declaring his words to Jacob, his statutes and his judgments to Israel. He hath not done so to any nation, as to judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye Jah. Chapter 148 Praise ye Jah. Praise ye Jehovah from the heavens, praise ye him in high places. Praise ye him, all his messengers, praise ye him, all his hosts. Praise ye him, sun and moon, praise ye him, all stars of light. Praise ye him, heavens of heavens, and ye waters that are above the heavens. They do praise the name of Jehovah, for he commanded, and they were created. And he establisheth them forever to the age, a statute he gave, and they pass not over. Praise ye Jehovah from the earth, dragons and all deeps. Fire and hail, snow and vapor, whirlwind doing his word. The mountains and all heights, fruit tree, and all cedars. The wild beast, and all cattle, creeping thing, and winged bird. Kings of earth, and all peoples, chiefs, and all judges of earth. Young men, and also maidens, aged men, with youths. They praise the name of Jehovah, for his name alone hath been set on high, his honor, 
is, above earth and heavens. And he exalteth the horn of his people, the praise of all his saints, of the sons of Israel, a people near him. Praise ye Jah. Chapter 149 Praise ye Jah. Sing ye to Jehovah a new song, his praise in an assembly of saints. Israel doth rejoice in his Maker, sons of Zion do joy in their King. They praise his name in a dance, with timbrel and harp sing praise to him. For Jehovah is pleased with his people, he beautifieth the humble with salvation. Exult do saints in honor, they sing aloud on their beds. The exaltation of God, is, in their throat, and a two-edged sword in their hand. To do vengeance among nations, punishments among the peoples. To bind their kings with chains, and their honored ones with fetters of iron. To do among them the judgment written, and honor it, is, for all his saints. Praise ye Jah. Chapter 150 Praise ye Jah. Praise ye God in his holy place, praise him in the expanse of his strength. Praise him in his mighty acts, praise him according to the abundance of his greatness. Praise him with blowing of trumpet, praise him with psaltery and harp. Praise him with timbrel and dance, praise him with stringed instruments and organ. Praise him with symbols of sounding, praise him with symbols of shouting. All that doth breathe doth praise Jah. Praise ye Jah.